Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Robert Kelly, a.k.a. the dude, a.k.a. the king of Zoom. Thanks for checking out the Calter and Kelly YouTube page. We hope you like what we're putting up there. Make sure you go to patreon.com slash Robert Kelly and sign up over there because every week we put a show, an extra show, Friday show, only Patreon. And we also have the J.O. party on Saturday night, only Patreon. That means you, all the fans, get to come into a Zoom and hang out with us and all the other ladybugs, and uh, it's it's a blast. So we also let you watch all the shows live, YKWD Live, all the Calter and Kelly's live, unedited, all go on the Patreon, and you also get the 10-minute extra YKWD Every week goes on there, along with Live from the Shed, one-on-ones, Tech Talk with Bobby and Friends. There's so much content up there. And you know what? It's all for what? A price of a cup of coffee. Five bucks gets you in the door. And uh, you're going to love it. So make sure you go over there, patreon.com slash Robert Kelly. And here's another little thing I want you to do. If you like this content we're putting up, subscribe and like. That's it. Just hit the little button, subscribe, so you know when we got a new show out. And then like it, so we know you like what we're doing, okay? That's it. Patreon.com slash Robert Kelly. Subscribe and like. Now, enjoy the show. This is the comedy event you've been waiting for. Put it down, you fat bastard! <laughs> Comedian Robert Kelly will be performing live in front of an audience and streaming it right to your living room. <laughs> you're, you're old as shit because you, cause your hair is feathered. <laughs> January 30th, 2021. Robert Kelly from Comedy Central, Netflix, and HBO will be doing his hilarious, crude, but vulnerable stand-up live from the Wall Street Theater and streaming it around the world right to you. Robert Kelly live stream pay-per-view from the Wall Street Theater, January 30th, 2021. Artie Lang knows. <laughs> yeah, baby. We're starting the podcast right now. We're back. You know what, dude? Live. Welcome, everybody, to the show. YKWD. I started a social media and podcast. <laughs> the back. The YKWD podcast. YKWD is back again. Old school. Back in the day. Where it all started. Before them all. YKWD. This podcast is so fun and crazy. It has no rules. Shut up. You're ruining this. Where's the ball man? Sorry, it's a comedy podcast. This isn't NPR. That's what this podcast does. Is there any better show? This is the original. Original. Ho, ho, ho. And Merry Christmas, everyone. To all you out there, my Catholics and Christians. And even my Jews, I want to welcome everybody to this year's uh, digital Zoom StreamYard 2020 Yankee Swap YKWD. Bobby, you said everyone except the Protestants, and I agree with you. The Protestants <laughs> cannot celebrate today with us. Bobby, who are the other two hoes? Whoa! <laughs> still got his good stuff. He's still yeah. got it. But welcome, folks, to you know what, dude. You thought <laughs> the show didn't exist anymore, but evidently yeah. it's still going somehow. You know, if you if you put in a lot to a podcast, you can always guarantee you'll be in the intro, unless you're Joe List, Dan Soder, and Joe DeRosa. <laughs> then you'll never First be in all, the intro. Listen, you're, Joe DeRosa's in the intro, by the way. Oh, that just stings. You put a sandwich maker before two of your favorite comedians? <laughs> ow, 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 my belly button. <laughs> well, let's rip you open, Bobby. I don't know. Why do you... <laughs> yeah, yeah. He called him a sandwich maker. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, fuck. Joe's making sandwich. Joey Roses. Yeah, dude. You, he got broke. He, and broke I tell you, I told Joe back in the day, I go, why don't we do this together? You know what, dude? We'll be Joe DeRosa and Robert Kelly. We'll split everything. And he goes, yeah, nah, I'm good. Damn. Yeah, but thank God. This show would be horrible. <laughs> it's not great, but it would be horrible. Dude, if you guys were bitching over a little small t-shirt money. Ow. <laughs> yes. Um, 
Well, I'd be bitching right now because he put a, he would have quit to make sandwiches. You go, Bobby. I gotta fucking make this nice Italian on a on a nice soft, soft, supple white bread. You're like, yeah, you, gotta, you, gotta, you put a whole pepper on. It's round, right? So when they bite the sandwich, it doesn't close right. They'll I'm have done. to cut it themselves. I don't want to mock Joe anymore. I want to actually be honest and let you know that he has motivated me. So in 2021, get ready for Dan Soder Lunchables. They'll be available anywhere you go. <laughs> what is what is the DeRosa sandwich bit? I don't know what's going on here. Oh, he makes sandwiches at the stand. For the stand. He makes sandwiches. He doesn't do stand-up anymore. He makes he has a, sa- a pop-up shop at the stand, and he makes eight sandwiches, eight delicious. I haven't had one yet. I heard they're awesome. And um, and uh, corporate Dan, <laughs> I, exactly corporate Dan, you cocksucker! You come out of the gate swinging it, throw, so you get us all on board. You go, but they're really good. I heard they're awesome. He's doing a great job. They're great. Fuck you. I am high as yeah. fuck, Lou. <laughs> uh, Joe DeRosa is he makes a t- there's a tuna fish, there's a peanut butter and jelly, there's an Italian, there's just you can't well, stop breaks, pump them. You can't, you can't fucking, you can never put a PBJ on a lunch. What, what the fuck are we? Ten? Is this school lunch? I'm, I'm all for not it. make a PBJ. PBJ were delicious. That's all I've been eating. Know. I've been eating that the entire pandemic. Yeah, like I said, for grownups, <laughs> for adults who need a lunch, you're gonna go and have a peanut butter and jelly. First yeah. of all. There's nothing to it. It's peanut butter and jelly. Like when Simple. he makes his, his Italian sandwich, I say Joe DeRosa knows what he's doing. He knows how to put uh, certain layers in, knows how much meat to put in, knows what type of peppers, some oil, salt. But who the fuck doesn't that? Uh, peanut butter and jelly, anybody can make that. He has the body of someone that can make a good Italian sandwich. He has the he has the body that he knows what wet meats are supposed to feel like <laughs> together. <laughs> yeah, he he looks like a gabagol hanging in an Italian yeah. deli. <laughs> oh, dude, I bet they make DeRosa make all of his sandwiches in a wife beater and an Italian horn necklace. That's how you have Joe to know. Joe can't wear a wife beater because it slides off his shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> Ends up becoming one of those cross tanks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So Lewis is Lewis is just why, straight up disrespected you and not showing up, huh? Yeah, Lou, uh, she's I don't know, Gabby. He said Al- he'll be here in one minute. All right, Damn. and he'll be here in a minute. How Joe, many why are you go? hiding your small mouth with the microphone? Let's see it. There he is. Uh, oh, whoa! <laughs> I had surgery during <laughs> pandemic. <laughs> I'll give you a hundred bucks if you can fit that microphone in your mouth. Try, try, try. Oh, no, nope. dude. dude. Oh, oh, cute. Oh, oh that hurt. Dude. I that just located insane. something. I don't want to show you guys how fucking much of a slut I am that I could definitely down this old big black thing. <laughs> <clears throat> well, of course, people who don't know, um, we have our Yankee swap every year, and this pandemic was not going to stop us. Uh, we're doing it digitally where we figured out, I think, and hopefully Gabby has figured it out, uh, where we are going to uh, we <laughs> mush Look at Mush. He's just a we'll mush. try. Nothing, <laughs> nothing is better for the background of Suarez than just open drawers on a dresser behind yeah. him. Nothing. I, I'm, I'm moving much. again. I like that the producer oh. has the worst lighting and background. <laughs> <laughs> Can't and hear no microphone. Either. His mic's off. <laughs> Hello. He's, I just got uh, off a plane. Dude, we have to check. Oh, in. You got COVID. Bro. Are your arms tired? Bobby, where's the bandana? Where's the bomb dana? Bobby. <laughs> no, but your sure. knees are tired. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, fuck you. Um, so we have, of course, Lewis is late. And he look, he he admitted this to me uh last year because I was late for something. He goes, Are you doing my power move where I show up late? Uh, Perfect so timing. He there he is now. It's a power uh, move. I'm- Dreaming <laughs> of a white power, <laughs> no. just like my Hitler used to Jesus want. Christ, can you not? 
Now this fucking whole show is demonetized. Where you know, the you know white funny, though, man Lewis. owns property Lewis, and uh, the black man is property. Lewis doesn't understand that some of those white power guys would turn on him immediately. No <laughs> way, like, dude. You're a goddamn island Mexican? Get the fuck out of here. Oh, yeah, I'll show them my fucking 23 and me and they'll be like, oh shit, dude, this guy's got some fucking fuck. Euro blood. Actually, Lewis, <laughs> considering you're speaking to a true Aryan prince, just know that you lack the white man blood that i have coursing through my veins uh dan listen to me my white blood is so strong that it actually overtakes my brown skin it can't that's impossible and i know that because i'm deeply into eugenics <laughs> <laughs> i actually got 23 in me for dawn and myself for christmas did you have to do a 46 and up <laughs> <laughs> fuck off i hope that tea's hot burn you burn your mouth yeah. what happened with the 23 in me are you gay <laughs> is that what it does it tells you you're gay yeah it says you're 17 percent gay <laughs> uh, are, you, are you are you teasing the story bob i no i <laughs> <laughs> what do you know about teething <laughs> i only half get it but i liked it that <laughs> was a small mouth joke i see uh, uh all right, well, welcome, Luis Gomez. Uh, we're glad you're here. We have a special guest today. Um, what, <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you doing that? You know why I'm doing that. He did that on purpose. He's trying to fucking alpha me right now, doggy. <laughs> Dude, I hate that you guys. <laughs> I forgot that it's 20 minutes of you guys smelling each other's buttholes. On every <laughs> <one of them. laughs> I forgot that. That's what it is. It's just like it's like when two dogs they, they get yeah, start fighting a little bit, but both owners uh, like just let them fight. Nah, they'll be fucking playing in a second. They're barking right now, but we're not like pit bulls. We can't actually do any damage. It's two chihuahuas <laughs> that are just fucking uh, side mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I heard it. Louis, you got called out yesterday on Twitter. Some kid wants to come fight you. By who? Oh, on my uh, Instagram, I posted it. Yeah, I told, I told him to fucking come. People pop all this shit. I'm like, all right, doggy, fucking come here. I'll give you my address. Come fight me. And then he was like, oh, hey, dude, I'm a fan. Wait, really? So a guy was like, I want to fight you. And then you're like, here's where I live. And he was like, yeah. uh, do you want to do my podcast? Well, because here's the thing. I need I need more sparring partners anyway, right? So I spar and I spar with professional fighters. And they beat the shit out of me. So I'm like, all right, this guy's not going to be able to do what they do. So in the worst case scenario, I just get a good sparring session. And the best case scenario, I got a viral video of me beating up an internet troll. Yeah, or just some fucking guy from down at the docks just lays you yeah. out. And then yeah. takes or all of Gas Digital. Or he has a viral video of him beating up an internet troll. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Dude, Ow. your lifeline is really short. You're fucked. Seriously, you're, calm. you're fucked up. You're, really Dude, calm. you're gonna die. I'm gonna like, kill you. Joe's like, on fire. Dude, Joe's, Joe's on, on fire. fire. I'm not even kidding. I know about palm reading, Lewis. Like you're gonna like die young. Where's just, my lifeline, really? <laughs> It's that one that stops like really short. Yeah. That's fucked up. Seriously. Are you saying that hey, like we're dude, shocked that what about me? Die young. So do you're oh Jesus. Dan, you're not gonna make it through the podcast. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're fucked, bro. Dude, fuck you. Yeah, no, you guys are both in trouble. What about I'm me? I'm not even trying to be funny. No, Bob, you're good. You're gonna last a long time. That's Just keep smoking. Impossible. Bobby's going to die of heart disease Bitch. before anybody. <laughs> Bitch, my lifelines are great. Your fucking lifeline's over. Mush, hold your lifeline up. He can't, even, light, the camera, you he can't even hold his hand up. That's how <laughs> out of shape he is. He's Mike, has Sim Mike has Simpson hands. Yo, why is your? Why do you have a, a fucking head growing out of your palm? What the fuck is that? Suarez, do you have a hand inside of your hand? What, what is, is that? Are you wearing a hand? <laughs> his hands felt just like two balloons. <laughs> <laughs> Gabby, Wait, hold my. your hand up. Oh, Gabby, hold your vagina up to the camera. Okay. First of all, you don't have uh, Gabby only has two lines. Everyone else has three lines in their hand. No, I have three. Look, yeah, it's Gabby's Jewish. Also, God damn it. I, who, nobody, Gabby, you're so beautiful, but your hands suck. Like, you I have know. bony. Like, imagine she's trying to give you a hand job. It would fucking oh. cut your dick up. I feel, like, I feel like a skeleton tickling your pickle. <laughs> Gabby, yeah, Halloween town, baby. If Gabby if fingered a woman with those hands. If Gabby fingered a woman, her finger would be coming out the woman's mouth. Oh, 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 <laughs> it's long. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, Dan got it. Oh, oh, oh. Dan, <laughs> Dan didn't get it. He just saved his friend from drowning. Hi, right, I'm Firefighter Dan. I'll pull you out of a burning joke. <laughs> Joe could blow uh, her fingers. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
listen. So we got a very special guest today. We got two special guests. Dude, I'm sick of you fucking loading this up. This is supposed to be a family event. Yeah. No more it fucking fa- guests. Look, I would ne- I'm not loading it up. I'm not putting anybody on that shouldn't be on. Bobby, I don't know why your nose looks like you're in digital underground with those glasses, but the lighting is fucking me up. What are you talking about? <laughs> it looks, it looks like DJ Skrillex let himself go. Yeah. With the glasses, you go. He's just putting. Wow. We got it, dude. We got it. It was a. DJ. I was doing my DJ dude thing. Yeah, fuck face. no, we got it. We I got was it. acting out a fucking hilarious. No, we got thing. it. No, we got it. Dude, is Mike ever... choking? His face is all blue. No. Are you okay? Um, yeah. You got cold lighting. You got to. Uh, you got to warm. Warm it up. Well, it's too. Yeah. Ah. Yeah, you look like you're in Antarctica, Suarez. It looks like <laughs> it looks like you're reporting from the bottom of the planet. You remember, in Scro- you remember in Scrooge when the guy freezes to death, uh, like in the sewer? That's what he looks like right now. He looks like he's <laughs> Bobby, did you invite your new family to this? Calta and fucking Feeney, because he's in the introduction. Mike Feeney's in the no, introduction. He's not. No, he's yes. not. He's in the introduction. First of all, Lewis is in the introduction, and Joe DeRosa is in the introduction. But Joe List and I are not. I Joe, be in the Joe not. List is in the introduction. What? No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. You can hear yourself. What do I say? Hi, isn't Robert? Joe listening in the introduction? Robert Bartholomew uh, Kelly. Are you Joe, telling me your, I am your manager not? manager wouldn't approve it, Dan. What? Your manager wouldn't approve it. Bullshit. I'll get him on the phone right now. I'll get I'll get my what whole I'll get my whole team on the phone. Can Could I you get my manager on the phone too? He won't answer my calls. <laughs> <laughs> no, your 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 manager would your in your manager. I gotta know who your manager oh, was. What's going manager? on, bud? You getting out of a mud pit there? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. stuck. <laughs> I have an agent that I haven't spoken to in nine months. <laughs> <laughs> you know how happy he is? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's an idiot. I'm making more money than I've ever made in my entire life. If he had any fucking clue how the internet oh, worked, he would fucking be oh, digging he, in. He goes, his fucking Adderall speeches, we all have to sit through, like, where his agent. He goes, I'm going to tell you right now. I, I do an about alternate fuel. Alternate fuel is the wave of the future. <laughs> That's what you got to do. <laughs> <laughs> uh so yes we have two special guests let's introduce soda should be in a v- uh, every intro all right hey, lou thank you lou hell yeah lou those because I, I i but his manager wouldn't let me put him in the intro so that's bullshit that's yeah, total line, dude. Thing. that's too, i have complete con- creative control all right say something right now that you'll be in the intro we'll put it in for forever oh man no. bobby you you farted that's no. pretty good one more time. Oof. Go. Oh, man. This podcast was way more fun in person. No, we'll do it again. <laughs> Is that good? Why no. are you doing it in character? Yeah, <laughs> not weird. You. Joseph, this is this is me yelling at you for the intro. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I don't know, dude. Go through the catalog. Pull a, pull one of <laughs> my classic hits. What do you think go I have? A, I'm Van, Eddie Van Halen. I have a wall of just go back, catalogs. I can go just back go to through. one of our first albums when I was really just finding myself on the mic. You could probably find a good line there. No? All right. Just say, just say YKWD is my favorite. You know what, dude, is my favorite. Can you say it with fucking at least a fucking bit of enthusiasm? A Gabby, can it? Bobby? I'm gonna need my. It's gotta be a moment of like energy. It's also can be you can't it can, you can't just spell it out. Why QWD is my favorite. It's gotta be like a moment of like holy shit, this is great. Oh my god, like that. get that, get Lewis doing that. Uh, that was awesome. Why QWD is so much fun. No, 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 get no. That. You're like spelling that. it out, dude. You're fucking. Right. You, you can't, it's gotta be a little more subtle. It's gotta be like what was he even talking about there? Oh, dude, you got all the answers. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Get yeah, that, yeah, Mike. yeah. Put that. Put that in the oh, intro right oh. at the end. Oh, Bobby, you're Bobby. You're so wise. <laughs> this is awesome. All right, yeah. Let's juice up. Let's let's right, juice you up. Get, I'm intro. gonna get all three of you guys in the intro. Lewis, go. Um, perfect. That was great. Here's mine. Go. I want to fuck a kid. <laughs> I like it. Put it in. Dan, go. Uh, I need another coffee. That's pretty good. Well, you really. Lewis really had a point about you. Yeah, I say what we bring the in the next the the guest, the special one of the special. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you fuck it. I know you bony cock. Oh, awesome shirt! Thanks. Wow, dude. you got Bobby on your shirt. That's awesome, dude. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Lewis, I was going to get that one, Lewis. <laughs> Fucking douchebag. <laughs> Who's? Why? How do we have guests? There's too many of us. It's gonna be like the E Street Band. 
We're gonna call him Big Van Vey Durr. Yeah, Ready? Right. You right guys, ahead. this is. I mean, look at you guys. Love this next guest. I know, but there's gonna be too many. So too do you want to not have the? All right, here we go. Ready? Bring in the guest, Mush. Wow! wow. 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 I was just thinking, how could this show get less money? <laughs> Thanks for having me. It feels good to be here. Honestly, oh, I've been backstage dude. for 15 fucking minutes. Scopo, it's cool that you could take a break uh, fixing brakes to come and be on this podcast. <laughs> Buddy, we really I, appreciate it. I was working at my mechanic shop, and they called me in for this, so thank yeah. you. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. It's been three fucking years. I finally got an invite back to the show. You had Deep Pool on before me. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> well, can I just stop you real quick? We no, yeah, fuck. Pool. No, I'm talking, Bobby. I've been on stage for fucking 17 years. Oh, oh, shut the fuck up. Shut, shut up, up, Bobby. Shut up, Bobby. Bobby shut up, Bobby. Oh, we can't, we can't chat that's because that's we're on a fucking stream, so nobody can line it up. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Uh, this is great. I mean, yeah, Deep, you couldn't stand Deep Pool on the fucking show, but you had him before me. Yeah, Thank he you. In person. Man, he smelled good. Like we were about to put the band back together because of him. Uh, you should have, honestly. Uh, Deepu said no. That's why we we called you. I know. I got the fucking text messages an hour and a half ago. I realized that. <laughs> you know? That's why there's no Christmas in my background. I couldn't go to the store because I was on hold for the last 27 minutes in the background here. Thank you. Like Scopo's doing like a leery thing, like he's just fucking ranting, just fucking giving it to <laughs> yeah. us, like tell her like it is. Keep uh, going, Dennis Miller. What <laughs> else? Don't go off on a rant here. That's all, that's, Scopo. That's, this is all the this is all the comedy I've done in ten months. Let me have yeah, it, dude. Wait, this ten is years. All the you've done in fucking ten. Oh, you son of a bitch. Uh, Scopo, that's take why, your, That's why take, he's quick. That's why he's quick. Take your finger off your walkie-talkie so we can talk. <laughs> Where did you get that microphone at Ha Comedy Club? Yeah, uh, are you very good? Yeah, uh, no, I got it on eBay, Joe. Thank you, just like your hat. Dude, I got oh, it. Oh, oh, shit, Scopo oh. nailed them. No, no, no. the same no, hat you have on, Bobby. That was not safe good. today. Yeah, dude. <laughs> no, he's safe. No one's safe when Scopo's Scopo, in the house. Yeah, Scopo's got fucking Kmart announcement, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> he's fucking shitting on everyone. <laughs> he's got the energy when somebody like quits their Kmart job, but he tells the manager to fuck yeah. off. Uh, yeah. And also, we changed the labels on most of the food. Fuck off. <laughs> Kmart sucks. This is, my, this is my viral video. It's going viral. I can't wait. Yeah. Uh, Donnie, got- Donnie in the sporting goods section. Fuck you too, bro. By the way, I've been coming in the sheet sets for six <laughs> months now. Scopo's gotten a lot more attractive. Yeah, dude. Scopo yeah, got a lot of yeah. weight. Yeah, I got jacked during this. It was good. I actually I gained some weight back, but I'm still fucking in way better shape than Gomez. So Are you running, Scopo right? came on real last whoa, podcast. He took his shirt off. He had fucking abs. It was wild. Yeah, I got abs and everything. Damn, Scopo, you're a hot boy now. No, yeah, he's no, still got the big no, butt. No. He's still got that big black. Girl. That. I, I lost it a little bit. bit. I lost it a little bit. Honestly, it's not that. It's not there anymore. Let's see no, it. We'll take your shirt off. Show the butt. Let's see I'll it. show Let's the butt. I'll show the butt. Let's see. Come on, dude. You look like a delivery biker in New York in the nineties. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you could wear gray sweatpants. Have a fuck them. Oh, still there. Look at that oh. big wide uh, butt. I'm pushing forward. Pull those sweatpants up. Pop it out a little bit. Well, yeah. Pull that sweatpants down a little bit. Yeah. Well, fucking give me some of this Patreon money, and I will. Gabby, Gabby, I don't want to. I don't want to derail the conversation right now. But did you get lip fillers? I'm looking at how no. fat your fucking lips are. Something's going on there. They're real. They're real, baby. Why did you have thin? Why did you have fucking? What? Why did you have thin white girl lips? Look at she does I've this always had big lips. No, but she purses them. She does this. I have small tits, big lips. She does that. Look, watch. Look at. She does that shit. She does that. She's she's taught herself how to purse her lips. Just in normal you know, conversation. Oh, there it is. Look, you also do that. Guys, he's trying to eat. No, he, lead, he, lead, he leads into photos. He doesn't do that. Bobby's Dude. trying to inhale as much food as possible. That's his mouth. <laughs> it's full vacuum. I like, I like uh, Scopo's joke better. I think, but I like I think you we, saying it better. So if Scopo could give you that joke and you deliver it, it'd it. be funnier. Hey, guys. I what? think this is our new look. I like it, too. Hey, Gabby. Hello. Yeah. Hi, Gabby. Hey. Gabby, do you have to lick your lips a lot so they don't get dry? You Joe, do, do it. Joe, do it. Do what? Do it. Do it. Do it. Come on, Joe. Stop being an asshole. Just do it. 
Oh, Peter sure. Joe's lips look just like an asshole when he purses them. It looks like, <laughs> a, like a blown out porno asshole. Joe, look. Joe, le- Joe looks like if a baby's asshole prolapsed. The doctor's going to be like, <laughs> the doctor's gonna be like, Mr. List, I've never seen this before, but you pulled your upper mouth. Uh, <laughs> what did you do? He's like, oh. uh, Now, listen, we usually do this. Um, we have. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people. Well, there's only six of us right now, you yeah. fucking uh, idiot. Wait, well, we Scopo, got, we got, the Scopo part's done, right? Yeah, the Scopo <laughs> tied it off, right? I think we're good, right? <laughs> yeah, this I, is, hope, uh, I honestly, I didn't hear what you said, to be honest with you. It broke up. <laughs> it wasn't nice. No, we just... <laughs> You know, and, the, and for the you know for the sake of the holiday spirit, we just won't repeat it. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> That's sweet. I just switched from nice to naughty. Just a <laughs> heads up. Whoa, uh oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we got to go one at a time. It's only fair. I mean, Bobby, you're leading the show, so if you want to just you know jump in at any point. <laughs> <laughs> I was, I was doing doing waiting for Gabby to start leading it. It's fucking wild. <laughs> I was, I was Sco, Scobo takes the reins. Scobo's like, anyways, uh, the, Met, the, the Mets are going to look decent next year. Uh, <laughs> I hope Steve, Steve Cohen's on the team. I love it. It's good time. Uh, so uh, he starts giving yeah. the traffic on the BQE. So uh, yeah. seems uh, like uh, also, uh, my guest today is my cousin who has some very, uh, you know, outside opinions on masks. Uh, anyways, I'm just gonna start. Uh, I'm gonna start reading DeRose's lunch menu. Dude, do it, dude. Dude, I hope he... We should have had this all catered by Joey Rosa. <laughs> can, we, can we get the next one catered by DeRosa and not let him on a mic? Just we, have him bring sandwiches. To the like, like a morning radio show? Yeah. When like the, when they have the, the local restaurant the, brings in food for promotion. The, the uncharming dickhead from the barbecue restaurant who doesn't know how to promote his shit. Like, Joe's not... A, he's not a cook. Why? Like, I, I don't like his comedy, and he tries at that. How am I supposed to eat his sandwiches? Yeah, but better, a sandwich... Yeah, I don't know. A sandwich is like at least Scopo's cooking on his thing. He's actually starting from scratch making something. I mean, making sandwiches is Wait, not. Excuse me, is Scopo well, I didn't is realize Scopo was great. the Scopo show. Oh, no, Scopo has a food show that he does. Oh yeah, him and, his, him and his buddy talk sports. <laughs> <laughs> dude, 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 I make fucking sandwiches. I make bread. I make bread pudding. It's good stuff. Yeah, no, dude, Scopo stuff. does. Scopo does. Scopo, you didn't know he did that. He makes a. He has a dude. food show. No, they don't watch my Instagram stories. Dude, they don't give a brother, shit. I think it's with his brother and his kid. Listen, when they listen, talk about you. sports. They do sports as they're cooking. So it's like, yeah, yeah you want to put a little paprika in? The Jets aren't really playing that right today. But you know what? Next week is a better week for them. Pass me the salt. It's Bobby. never a better week for the Jets, Bobby. You never take the Jets. I haven't laughed this hard on this podcast <laughs> since Joe and I both drank. Then when watching he and I both realized that we the Scopo actually has a cooking show, they <laughs> Joe and I just laughed so good. We were both like, what? <laughs> That's amazing. I mean, a pandemic is really doing some funny things to people. <laughs> <laughs> like it really, no, but, a lot of yeah, guys are wearing wigs. A lot of people are doing a lot of crazy shit. Oh, dude, god damn it, dude. That whole realization that Bobby was like, Yeah, you know, he's like Scopo cooks different. And Joe and I were like, What? <laughs> what do you mean it cooks different? <laughs> so, anyways, we have Ari Shafir oh. is playing the game. Okay. I thought he was in Spanish class. He's in Spanish class. No, he's actually taking boat ri- driving lessons somewhere he told me in South America. Spanish. But he sent us a video and okay. a gift. Good. So whoever picks his number will will play the video, and that's like the gift you're getting. What? I don't like this at all. This 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 is this is already hard enough on Zoom. Now we have to do this with a, a possible gift from South America. What are you doing, Bobby? This seems like a what setup too. It is. What? This is a setup. It's a setup. It's not a setup. There's no fucking setup, you paranoid guinea. Scopo's about to tell us to drive around. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, Bobby. Scopo never sits with his back to a door. He's like, yeah, you know what? Yeah. Fucking, no, I got to be in the corner here. Yo, listen, if you're listening to podcasts, this sponsor, one of my new favorite sponsors, 
They've been with me for a, a few here, and I'm very proud to have them on board. Uh, better help. Uh, you're listening to podcasts. You you need help, okay? Especially this one, okay? Because we're all looking for a way out from sadness, depression. Uh, you know, sometimes you don't know how to get places. You listen to the podcast so you can find out how to get to your goals and how to get through troubled times or f- get out of feeling bad. Sometimes podcasts and TV shows aren't going to cut it. You need something more than that. Better help. You need somebody to talk to. I've been talking to somebody for years. I use this company, okay? BetterHelp is going to assist you in in, in getting you somebody, not just anybody, somebody you match with, a therapist that you like. That's the worst when you get a therapist and they stink. I had a therapist one time, had two dogs that growled at me, the whole, like lions going, the whole therapy sucked. Better help's not going to have that. You're going to get professional help, professional therapist that you connect with privately. Guess where? Online, in your own home. You don't have to go somewhere. That's another thing. I got to drive 45 minutes into the city, find parking for God knows how much, and then sit in a lobby with other crazy people, you know, with some stupid sound machine. You can still kind of hear in the room. That's not going to happen. That does not happen here. You do this in the privacy of your own home. You'll be able to send messages to your counselor anytime and get prompt, thoughtful responses right back. And you can schedule a weekly video sessions and phone sessions. You can do it on the phone. You can do a video. It's more affordable than traditional therapy too. That's huge. Okay. They have financial aid available for people. Dude, I can't afford it. Yes, you can. Wake up. It's affordable now with better help. You'll be able to get help you need. And we all need some help. Trust me. I've been out of my mind my whole adult life. Okay. I've been, I've been, I've been searching for something like this and been able to talk to somebody neutral. You can't go to your wife and tell her your deepest, darkest, craziest thoughts. She'll leave you. You can't go to your best friend and tell him something. He'll have ammunition on you. You need a neutral person to be able to help you with the needs so you can you can get to where you want to go to in life and at least be happy and feel great, all right? So here's the deal. This is what I want you to do. You're going to be able to go to better help, but I want you to, uh, I want you to, you know, because look at depression. Who's got that? Me. Stress, bing, anxiety, bang, anger, hello, relationships, woo, I'm married, trauma, yes, from when I was a child, self-esteem, I hate myself, and tons of other stuff. Okay, you're going to be able to get help from better help. Listen, my listeners, all you guys out there and girls, uh, it's great to talk to somebody. Okay, you need to get it off your plate so you can feel good. It's a hard time right now being home, being locked up, losing your job, not have enough money, Christmas, holidays, family, friends. It's a lot. It's a lot for all of us. So, please, I want you to do this. Reach out. I want you to start living a happier life today. As a listener, you'll get 10% off your first month by visiting our sponsor at betterhealth.com slash dude. Join over 1 million people who have taken charge of their mental health. Again, that's betterhelp, H-E-L-P.com slash dude. All right, now listen. Are we gonna are we gonna play the thing we usually play that everybody hates playing? Yeah, Rose Purple Rose of Cairo. <laughs> I mean, Rose Thorn Seed. Are we doing that? We have to. We do it every time. All right. Are we doing that first and then doing the Yankee Swap? Correct. We'll do it quick. Everyone has the same same shit. Yeah, right, Rose can- is fucked a kid. Thorn is fucked an adult, and Seed is uh is a new kid on the way. <laughs> 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 All right, Lewis. Oh my God, Lewis, do you want to start Rose Thorn? Do uh, you want to explain to the audience first what it is again? Because so Rose is the th- your thing you're most happy for this year, right? Yeah. Thorn is the thing that's a kind of a pain in the dick this year, and then your seed is the thing that you're essentially what you're excited about that you've started up or something that's happening that will hopefully be fruitful and maybe even be your rose next year. Well said, Lewis. Beautiful, well gorgeous. Said. 
Damn, well, Lewis, you've you've really came into your own, bud. New yeah, Jersey's oh, that was actually perfect. Damn, Lewis, that should be the drop right there. Damn, <laughs> Lewis. Damn, right. Lewis. Damn, Lewis. Uh, so, all right, so my uh, my uh, my uh, my uh, thorn is pink eye. The <laughs> <laughs> I've never met anybody who has pink eye more than fucking Lewis. <laughs> yeah, Lewis, it's like you and five year olds get yeah. pink eye. No, the it's a I, don't have, I don't have a sty anymore. Stye. Big J is. I think I've given Big J my uh, my recurring sty problem because Big J always has a sty now. Yeah, did you die? You put it. You dropped it in when he was sleeping. I just mm-hmm. shit right in his eye. <laughs> <laughs> um no yeah i mean obviously it's gonna be for everyone the thorn's gonna be the same for everybody it's this fucking stupid fucking fake disease this fake pandemic <laughs> pandemic the pandemic dude lewis it's is gonna fake. be the funny the, lewis is gonna be the funniest guy on the ventilator when he gets hit and he's like i just want to say it i'm no longer a real ass dude i'm actually a uh I just want to say, baby James, James, I am walk over here. <laughs> that weird breathing that he's going to have to do. Hey, guys, welcome back to Real Ass Podcast. <laughs> you know who's saying? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah I mean, obviously, it's the fucking pandemic. It's been a pain in the ass for everybody. Um, you know, some some worse than others, but, you know, it is what it is. It sucks, and I'm hoping that this shit is fucking behind us, and that should probably be everybody's thorn this year, if I had to guess. Oh, right, what you, no. if you if you didn't want to do it for everybody else, what would be yours? Well, I got to be honest with you. Gas Digital has been thriving since this pandemic hit. And, um, you know, online content has fucking exploded. The advertising company has been doing really, really well. So, you know, for me anyway, the pandemic is sort of my uh, rose. But for you guys, I would understand how it's a pain in the ass. And it's a little inconvenient at the very least. Okay, so can you again, can you tell us? Yeah, what for us comedians, it's been hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I hope it never comes back, Joe. I hope you have to get a fucking day job. Whoa. And, um, oh, wow. I have a very <laughs> successful, extremely successful partner, so I'm doing just fine, too. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, the thorn is, is the pandemic. The rose... Um, Wait, no, we go one at a time. We'll come back around oh, to you. Thorn. Okay, good. Thorn. My thorn is the pandemic. All right, who's next? Scopo, we got to assume your thorn is that shirt. <laughs> <laughs> my thorn's the Chinese. That's what my thorn is. There we go. Uh, there we go. I got to keep it Queens. I got to keep it Queens. <laughs> um, so, yeah, the Chinese. Okay. Okay, uh, Mush, what's yours? He lost his belt. <laughs> Stairs. I can't wear a belt. <laughs> 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 so There's both spellings. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Yeah, stairs. It's stairs. stairs. Okay, what do you got, Gabby? Uh, uh, the pandemic and my ex-boyfriend. No, you Ooh. won. You break, up, oh. break up. Break up. Break up. Went through a break up. Oh. The break up with the break tattoo up. guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any any revenge porn you want to send my way, girlfriend? Absolutely huh? not. No. Sweeney shots. None of that. Wait, why? So the thorn was, uh, isn't it? That, that should be good, though. That should be your seed because now you have a new life. You That asshole's behind you. Yeah, go you get your group. Back. You go got that fucking. Back. Also, like Gabby, not Robin. Robin. Let her fucking pick her own seed mm. and thorn. No. no, you oh, know no what, I like motivational, Lewis. Exactly. No, you're fine. This is a new you. He's just okay? trying to fuck you. Got those fucking. No fat shit. <laughs> got that fucking tight butt. Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> Well, all right, Lewis. Why did you go so strip club manager with your hands behind your head? Like that? <laughs> so, yeah. Good. So you're a dancer, but are you an erotic dancer? <laughs> Don just showed up. Max yeah. has been inside alone eating chocolate graham crackers by himself because she didn't show up. Say hi, to yeah. Lewis. Hi, Don. Hi, Don. How are you? Hi, Don. You're too good for him. Hi, Don. You're perfect. You're there's, a much, there's a much better man in Boston like you should have married. <laughs> yeah, Dan just said that. I'm so he's sorry so this happened that, to you. There's no uh, way you saw me. it ending up this way. That he, yeah. Yeah. Every, but everybody's you know, complimenting. A, I never thought you'd be in a shed in Westchester. Dan just said, this is great that he bought this shed. really helped me out. Don, yeah. you left your, your husband left your son alone while he sat in a shed <laughs> talking to yeah. a bunch of right He said, yeah, just said I'm the father he's always wanted. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we're on suicide watch for Scopo. If you see him grab a gun, just get ready. I, to call I, I got headphones that she can't hear you. Oh, okay. 
<laughs> Anyways, back to your thorn girlfriend. Was it the breakup? <laughs> it was the breakup. <laughs> Why is it a thorn though, Gabby? Shouldn't it be positive though? Like you're 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 still are you still reeling over? You're still sad. Wait, when, did that, when, what? when did this breakup happen? Uh September. All right. And but it's this is my whole I'm looking at my whole year, you know. He was very hot. It's unfortunate he had to be a psycho. Oh, how is it? Same thing with me. Yep. Same with <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I dated Joe. Why what made him a psycho? Why do you say that? He was yeah, just uh <laughs> do you want to Gabby I don't have want to get too into it. Head? It's pretty cool, isn't it? Let's yeah, lean in. in. Big. Lean in. Hey, everyone talk at the same time right now. Again. Farts and Yeah. So what? No. Give me something that you can get into that made him a psycho. What would you define as a psycho? Because a lot of times psychos they fucking throw the psycho label upon other people, but sure. they're actually the psycho. Yeah. No, I'm not the psycho. He was clinically depressed in a big way. So you weren't there for example. him. You I him. was there for him. Way to abandon him. Oh. <laughs> 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 I take it all back. This is my thorn. This podcast is my thorn. <sighs> Your fingers are thorns. Jesus Christ. <laughs> 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 I know. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Put those fucking wands down, Maleficent. <laughs> yeah, all right. Jack, Nightmare Before Elm Street. Nightmare Before Elm Street. I fucked that up. Yeah, that's it. I that's can. all the details I need to. Dan, what do you got? I'm gonna. My thorn is the lamestream media. I'm sick and tired <laughs> yeah. of these. Yeah, uh, tell him. Tell him. No, uh, but for real. Fuck Dan's the got money. He's Republican. Yep, dude. Fucking stay off my lawn. Um... <laughs> But for real, though, fuck the 24-hour news cycle. It made everyone a psycho. It's social oh, wow. media. I, I brought, this is what a racist I am. Oh, I brought my, my own son and niece who are two little brown kids. We brought them to see a Santa Claus, like a photographer at a Santa Claus at their house. Like yeah. and they, they set up a winter wonderland in the backyard. It was like 200 bucks to take pictures of Santa because they're not doing it at malls anymore. But my kids started walking across the lawn, and I yelled at them. I was like, get off their lawn! Yeah, that's great. That's what fun. Yeah. What a sign of maturity. Get off of their lawn. At least cut it. Dan, is that really your thorn? No, my thorn's the pandemic, Bobby. I haven't been able to do fucking stand-up since Mar I mean, I've done stand-up, but... Oh, don't take it out on me. I'm just asking. I'll take it out on you. I'm mad about everything. I Actually, my thorn... You know what my thorn is? Is uh, fucking... Yeah, it's the pandemic. <laughs> it's just the pandemic. It fucking blows. I'm going to take that vaccine. They can track me all they want, like a water buffalo. Yeah. Joe, what do you yeah. got? My, my thorn is, and, you know, we haven't talked about this, and I haven't told many people, but I did have a deal with CBS in February, and because of the pandemic, it just didn't happen. It was a thing called Joe's Place. Uh, I thought it was called Tiny Mouth and Friends. <laughs> I thought it was Elf on a Shelf. <laughs> <laughs> This no. fall, what if we told you that elf isn't just on that shelf? Joe <laughs> is the elf. And he's in it's, Queens. Dom sure Herrera is an old Santa looking to get out of the game. <laughs> I'm sure it's your rose that my show fell through. But no, it was going to be, we had, we had already negotiated the money and everything. And, and uh, it was a bummer. Was, uh, Joe, who was the showrunner? Uh, Bill Wilson. Who, who, Wait, what was else it was a done? sitcom? It was a sitcom, CBS multi camera. Multi I developed it. Yeah, I developed it with. Um, what was the name of it? Jacob Ellsbury. Yeah, Jacob Ellsbury. Who was going to be the production Ellsbury. company? What was the production company? <laughs> it? it was um, uh, Martin and Lewis. Martin and Lewis. I don't think we ever heard of them. I've never heard of them. It was uh, uh, Scopo and uh, Gabby. <laughs> Oh. No, oh. Um, no, that's a joke, obviously. But I did have my. No, I, I, I didn't know it was a joke, dude, and I was. Giggling so hard that you <laughs> out. I was about to explode with laughter. I was so happy that that happened to you. <laughs> I'm upset that it didn't happen. No, I got nothing. But specifically, <laughs> the fucking piece of shit. I had a vacation planned one week before the shutdown. I was going to the Indian Wells tennis tournament with my friend Derek and his wife, and we were gonna swap wives and hang oh, out at the tennis. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and it all fell through. And now, now they're you know they hate us and uh, that would whatever. Been nice. Right. So that's my that's my thorn. Yeah, Bobby, what's your thorn? My thorn, my thorn is um. Stolta? <laughs> we get it. 
Somebody asked earlier if Bobby's wearing a tree skirt. And that's really <laughs> funny. <laughs> it really does. It looks chat? like a bib. Oh, wow. We can read the chat. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> my my thorn is that last year at this time, me and Don found the house of our dreams. And we were about to put a bid on it. And, uh, and, and then uh, I got a call from my agent and all f my, my year was booked until uh, 2021. So I was, I was set. I wouldn't have to worry about money, booking, get, doing anything for a year. Boring. I'm in a long time. And I did, I couldn't, we couldn't get the house. It's called a pandemic. So your thorns, a pandemic. No, no, <laughs> pandemic. no, I'm being, I'm no. being, I'm being, yeah. I'm it's finally it's it's No, it's the pandemic. Because, no, because the pandemic brought good things to me too, Scopo. What did it bring? Like what? It took away. We'll, 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 we'll get to that. my rose yet. I'm we'll get to that. I'm not at my rose. So, Scopo, you're wrong. All right? And whatever Scopo, pep talk you got from your fucking roommate, settle down. Yeah, I dude. live by myself with a dog now. I don't have roommates. As it should be. All right? Uh-oh. Uh -oh, that's very lone gunman talk. Oh, yeah. It's coming. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> just, I, know, I, know, I just I know I'm gonna duck until I hear the fucking bump stop drop out of the gun, the bump stock, what? and then I'm gonna what? run. Huh? I don't know. Where's the bomb, Dana? Lewis, bomb? Scopo just implied that he's suicidal. What would you? What would your advice be to him? Um, Listen to I'd my podcast. You do vertical slice vertically because if you do it the <laughs> yeah. horizontal way, you're not gonna. They could fix that. Yeah, that's for show. <laughs> I already I knew know, that. To go home. I, I learned that from uh, one movie. What movie did they teach you that in? Uh, I don't know. It was, was it Winona Ryder? It was Winona Ryder in Heather's. Girl interrupted. Heather's. Girl interrupted. Girl interrupted. Maybe it was Girl interrupted. Who cares? It was Girl interrupted. It wasn't Heather. Let's all kill her. Heather's, Heather's was Heather. crazy. What? Heather's like, was crazy. That was a crazy fucking movie. Steve's right. I don't know what a bump stock is. I was just using gun knowledge. Yeah, bump gun stock is something that helps you make a semi-automatic into an automatic. Damn, Bobby, you're Rambo. Scopo's like, somebody say bump? What? Where? Yeah, yo, bro. I'll I can't bump again. In the bathroom. But now that I know that, and now I can use that term appropriately. So, okay. Lewis, rose. Let's go. Lewis, what is your rose? Uh, my, rose guy? <laughs> <laughs> my rose was moving out to uh, the suburbs, moving out to Jersey. Yeah. Um, you know, it was. Uh, it was a move that I wanted to make for a while. And, you know, I got a, a house and a backyard and I get to fucking, you know, just have peace and quiet in my life. And, uh, yeah, that, it, it's definitely put me in a much better place psychologically. Um, I feel like I'm a fucking adult. When you have uh, an apartment, right, we got it. share walls with somebody. We got it. We got it. It's a whole, you know, you got to walk upstairs. We understand. No right. You, you know, All right. man, it would be fun to hear Lewis's neighbor's interpretation of this whole situation where they go, this fucking wild animal moved in next door. <laughs> He's doing karate training in his garage. <laughs> it smells like the whole neighborhood yeah. smells like weed. He and goes, there, there's a guy that he yells at named Harrington who just sleeps on his porch. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. He's a raccoon man. Uh, Lewis, are no you problem. mad? Are you mad that we're making fun of the suburbs? No, the suburbs rule. You can't make fun of the suburbs. You live well, in, you're in Jersey. I grew up Shit, in the suburbs. City. Uh, Bergen County. Mm. Yeah. It's only like a half an hour. I'm a, I actually get to the studio faster than when I lived in the city. No one cares. <laughs> Do you have a car yet? <laughs> I have a rental. How come you Scopo? Rent a car always, still? Scopo's the only one that sounds like he's talking from yeah. the back of the room. <laughs> <laughs> Scopo's mic isn't plugged in. Listen, Lewis, why don't <laughs> you just <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> Why don't you Lewis, are you okay? <laughs> what are you looking at? I know what Joe's laughing at. <laughs> Joe's laughing because when you said that, it's coming us. <laughs> I looked and being sure. Wow. Scopo, your sound is so bad. We've been in pandemic for nine months. Yeah. How do you sound like it's day one? Scopo, your camera sucks. Pocket. Your microphone sucks. Your personality sucks. Change you know, something. This is what my rose is. Being back on this podcast, it's Beautiful. so much fun. I love it. Mm -hmm. Don't you feel good about yourself doing it? Yeah, I felt great. I felt yeah. I have I had anxiety for twenty minutes while I was watching, and now I'm back here, so I feel good. <laughs>
We missed you. Now my fucking Gabby. internet's going out. Fuck we yeah. missed you, you thick ass Goomba. <laughs> Hips. Gabby, what? What, you, what is your rose? I want an Emmy. What? Yeah. She, where is it? Show us. What on an eBay bid? No. <laughs> no. Right there. She, she, go get it. It's not this. It's not a same size Emmy. It's like a. It's a small Emmy. Fuck you. It's a regional Emmy. I've it's seen regional. an Emmy. A guy oh, pays oh, yeah. me to clean his. Wait, did she say it's an a re yeah. it's a regional Emmy? Yeah. Wait, Lewis, was that a yeah? You? Like, um, <laughs> Wait, first it's off, a regional I Emmy. It's a regional Emmy. Is that a regional Emmy? A regional Emmy, baby. Wait, that's like, that's Morris, like a Spanish Grammy. That's what the what? Yeah. Mush, you've been yeah, dying. Say, I'm like, I'm something wrong with my Emmy. You <laughs> keep your shit. I don't want to see your face. I only want to hear your voice. Get off. A Spanish Grammy. That's so funny. That's what, so. What funny. did you win it for? Producing a documentary. Regionally. Regionally. <laughs> it was about it was about the Northeast. Yeah. A regional Grammy. A regional Emmy. It's about time. Uh, it was about his time zone. It was about the central time zone. <laughs> <laughs> pretty cool. Pretty ah, uh, 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 all you want, you pieces of shit. Uh, guys, I would have to say my rose is my county fair Oscar. <laughs> I got it. Big off in the act. Debbie has a blue ribbon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that. That'll do, pig. That'll do. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. How much did that? How much did that cost your father? Fuck <laughs> you. I got it all by you myself. Have, you piece Grammy. Of shit. That's two on the nose. Let me see if I can get a regional Emmy. <laughs> what was the documentary? It was about college hazing for my day job. Mm. Oh, mm. they started producing that before the pandemic started. They were like, "This is a real problem." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, real. yeah, yeah, yeah. Then the problem happened, and they're like, ooh, never mind. All right, Dan, what do you got? Worse. My rose has been my dog and my girlfriend. They have made me a person this year. I'd stopped being just doing all comedy and finally, like, fucking hung out and, you know, been a person, which has been pretty sick. But my dog, uh, yeah, my dog. Died? No, what? Why would you say that, you fucking asshole? I don't know. You paused. I don't know. I was yeah, going to try, dog, and then I was gonna try to bring her on the podcast, and then I was like, "Ah, she's in oh. a kennel. We just took a walk." Your, your girlfriend? Yep. The she's dog's in a kennel? Fine. Yeah, we do some kinky shit. Now, did your girlfriend mind that you don't live? You you still live with Mike Vecchione? No, I've been living with her during this whole thing. Vecchione and his girlfriend have been living in our place. We've, so is that done? Mm, I would say the spark is still there, so I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. He's been doing some intermittent fasting. He's really getting his body back. So. I like Hard how we work. care about Scopo so little that we just put his we put the uh, YKWD logo <laughs> over his face. Yeah. Here you go, Scopo. It looks like the YKWD logo. Yeah, Wait, put Switch it back. Mush. Switch it back. Scopo, so it looks do I have a time clock in front of my face? Well, Scopo looked like he was just in the waiting room for YKWD when the logo was over him. It's like coming up next, Chris Scopo's here. Mush, put me in the middle. Are you smoking weed, um, Bobby? No, I wish it was weed. Did I say that? I'm kidding. Whoa. I'm kidding. No, I don't care. I don't want weed. Um, all right. So who we get? Joe, what is your uh, rose? Hmm. <clears throat> well, my rose. Oh, boy. Yeah, similar to Dan, I think. I was on the road just too much. Road dog, 40 weeks a year for 10 years. And Making now too I'm, much money. You're right, dude. Just fucking I'm, working, building yeah. a fan base. That sucks. It's nice to be home a lot. And uh, I've really I been making money. Really in my own, own bed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm making money. I'm doing great over here. What are you kidding? Mark blew up while I was sitting at home. <laughs> No, it's uh, yeah. Being home a lot has been uh, been nice. I never get to live a life like this before. It's like I get to live an alternative life for a year. And we're gonna go back to the way it used to be. We'll never come back to this guilt free sitting at home. Oh, you lost me. What? Yeah. What? I'm saying, can, can you guys hear me? What happened? Oh, here? I was hoping you. Were, I was hoping you would act like it was paused because nope. it. it, I don't, it like, like, what does that anyway. mean? Feel free sitting at home. Your last part didn't make sense. I'm Here's saying that. right now they're like, "Hey, please stay home. Everything's closed. The shows are all closing. We can't gather. It's 25 percent here, 40 percent there. Blah blah blah." So we can enjoy it. I'm, I'm enjoying this year, but we will 
next year be back to shows every weekend, yeah. sold out, packed. But we'll never go back to a time where it's, hey, it would it'd be really nice if you'd stay home. So uh, I'm living it up over here. I'm watching movies. I'm I'm sucking my own dick. I, I Damn, take photos nice. of some naked kids. I'm having yeah. fun. Nice. Yeah, dude. And uh, and grateful for podcasts, obviously, because Lewis isn't the only one doing well. Oh. I bought a car. Oh, I was going to say, yeah, you're right. Tim Dillon is killing it. Yeah. <laughs> Don't you mock my, I, uh, my Don't road. You mock my what? Lewis? <laughs> you have a rental? Yeah, I have a rental car. <laughs> for how long? Uh, till January 7th. <laughs> how much is that? Oh, lease, car? Why you lease, oh, lease it. it. Lease a car uh, for 400 bucks a month. Why don't you buy it with cash like I did? Who's struggling? <laughs> Whoa. I mean, Whoa. I mean, there's a reason I'm renting the car right now. Why is it? You can't afford to buy one? Mm, <laughs> no, because I don't have a license yet. I only have a permit. So you have to have somebody drive you in and out of the city? Do you yeah. Have yeah. yeah. Wait. I always have someone in my car at all times. Do you have, have a 16-year-old with you? <laughs> Yeah, so I, can't, I, can't put a, I can't buy a car until I actually have my license. Oh, dude, what, are you, what are you going for your test? January 7th. Wow, don't fuck it up. <gasps> I, I, I my, first rent, my first rent test, I failed. It was pathetic. <laughs> Wait, you really? failed? Why? What'd nah, you do? That, that's because horrible. He's, he's you don't too need... fucking alpha. The guy was like, take a left. He's like, I'm going to take a right. It's quicker. Written, no, no, no. Test. Written yeah. test, Bobby. Written, Written test. test. Bobby, Bobby needs directions on how to write. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, Lewis, yeah, left. Lewis failed his first road test. It was headlining the funny bone in Omaha. <laughs> <laughs> you, just, you just bother teenagers in your neighborhood to help you learn how to drive? Are you like, hey, 17-year-old, come in here. You're, you're a sage old driver at this point. You want well, I had a, I had a when I was you know, 18 years old, 19 years old. Then I moved to New York City, let it expire, never did anything about it. And if you haven't had a license in five years, you have to have a permit for three months in the state of New Jersey before you're allowed to take a written test. Or before you're allowed to take the driving test. So I've just been waiting it out. Don't feel bad. Scopo can only drive a car with bench seats. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, I wish that wasn't true. All right. My rows would be similar to, I guess, uh, Dan's and Joe's. The pandemic really uh, slowed me down and got me to back to uh, over 300 pounds. I actually under 300 pounds. Hey. Before the pandemic, I was three, 336. Now I'm down to 295. Yeah. So, all right, Bobby. Uh, lost weight. Uh, and I actually got I, fat people, and this is me too. I'm saying fat people in general. You don't have a defined weight. Depending on how much salt you've eaten within that three day period, you can fluctuate 10 pounds in a given day. That's all people. Yeah, that's yeah. No, yeah. Okay, so what are you saying? What? What? Who? Huh? Who? Uh, Why? Huh? How? What'd you say? What? Are we about to kiss? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> what? Let's take our dicks out. So I would okay. say I would say the pandemic really slowed me down and uh and I got and like I got to spend more time with Max, which I love. And uh, and actually, spend more time with myself, and take care of myself spiritually, uh, mentally, and physically. I feel better than I did for a long time. Yeah. Gay. No, nope. I'm not gay. Oh, I figured that out. I'm not gay. I'm sorry. Psych- he tried though. He experimented a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. He goes. I sucked the dick. I didn't finish it off. You know. I kind of felt bad for leaving him hard. Well, I finished it off. It just. I didn't like the cum. Made me feel gross. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. See, I'm um, the opposite. I don't, I'm not gay, but I love cum. I just like oh, it. Get right. in line. Get in line, sister. It's gag. Yeah. It's gag for adults. <laughs> 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 Joe, have you ever tasted your own cum? Me. Yeah, You're I'm, the only the, I'm the Cal Ripken of tasting my own cup. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at 2,000, Iron Man. <laughs> 2,348 days in a row. That's how I start my morning. Uh, <laughs> uh, dude. <laughs> dude, you're the Iron Man of tasting your own cum is so fucking funny. I'm Cal Blumpkin. <laughs> What's that thing getting up? Lewis, have you ever tasted your own cum? Uh, on purpose once and then not on purpose like three times. Talk us through that. <laughs> Yeah, so the upper when I was like, um, you, you know, hungry like as a little boy. Oh, you just go, like, oh, that's salty. Yuck. Yeah. 
And then, um, yeah, then since then I've gotten into, when I've masturbated, I've had passionate moments where I was like, ooh, and then it just shot right into my mouth. And then you were <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> but you're coming, so it feels good. You're like, <laughs> <laughs> You're turning into a fucking uh, goblin. <laughs> and then you go, dude, I'm, you go, I've been eating a lot of pineapple. <laughs> Dan, if you have a prostate. Yeah, of course, dude. Yeah. Got no, it. like intentionally. Yeah, I, I usually do this. I go, all right, someone's been drinking his water. Get over here. Let's finish uh-huh. the match. No, I like, like, uh, when, you know, when I was younger, unintentionally, you're like, Oh, oh God! And it's never intentionally like Joe no, when he drinks it. I haven't, I haven't put it in my hand and been like. <laughs> I never freeze it. Feel it around. I freeze it in little ice trays and put it in my Pepsi. Oh, that's fun! Uh, and then nice. when it melts, it's like that's they can swim around in your Pepsi. I like that's that, so Joseph. Scopo, have you ever tasted your own jizz? Yeah, of course. When you get intentionally, in shape, when you get in great shape, you can't lose the protein. Yeah, bro. Right. Yeah, bro. Right. You do, you right. do, you right. do, I didn't see a protein Gabby. shake. That's what you do. What? Gabby, you, have you ever tasted the cake batter? Nah. What? Well, sometimes someone will go down on you and then they come up for a kiss you and never, then you get a little you taste. You oh, whatever. Little taste. So, oh, your boyfriend doesn't finger you and then shove his fingers into your mouth right Ex, afterwards? Ex boyfriend. Ex boyfriend. This is why they didn't and last. Tried. You never dated you a Z's? <laughs> that was my ex-boyfriend. Oh, Becky! I'm hey, Gabby, on, you don't suck I'm gonna shove the dick in your mouth. Treat yourself. Uh, called Stout Creamery. After you fuck him, you don't suck his dick. What? You don't. You fucking heard me, you prude. Whoa, Lewis! Whoa, Lewis you don't fuck me. After after a guy fucks you, you won't suck his dick. No. I'll suck yeah. his dick before. That's yeah. crazy, Gabby. I'm telling you right now that you're acting like that's a normal thing. That's a fucking wild thing that you won't even suck your own puss off his dick. Yeah, yeah, can't, can't. Lewis, Lewis is correct. It's like a it's like a quarterback that can't run in the modern NFL. <laughs> you need to at least be able to pick up the first down, Gabby. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Lesson, that's my seed. I can't wait. Hell yeah. That is right, where, weird. Where are we at? You should be able to. You should be able to at least. You know, what if yeah, he wants I mean, to pull like out? You, you, you got to suck him off and make him come after he yeah, pulls out. At least wipe yeah. him off. Wipe it off a little bit. No, I don't want to be wiped off. I want her to fucking. Just, What's no, that? Can you do that noise again, Lewis? Yeah. <laughs> That's oh, what I want. Okay, Lewis wants. That's I go. I go all the time from fucking to sucking to fucking to sucking. That's his whole life, dude. Lewis's yeah. whole life, just fucking and sucking. <laughs> <and fucking, laughs> <and fucking, laughs> Sometimes he means, dude. That's a documentary name. This is. It's very telling now. The type of lover that Gabby is. She is a boring person no. in the bedroom. Yes, no, Gabby. Gabby you think? No giraffe. Yeah. I do. I do think this. Well, and she she there's no, there's, but she does like butt play. Okay. She likes, That's, she likes ass play. Listen, I'm fun. Okay. I'm very fun in bed. I just don't blow you after you fuck me. That's crazy though. That's like, not, that's so vanilla. I think, no, never, never in the beginning. Lewis? Are you trying to like the guy? I mean, in before we have sex. Yes. Afterwards. I, uh. like, I have a problem going down on a chick after I've blown a load inside of her. But, but I will if she really wants it. It's because you're a team player. Okay. It's beautiful. <laughs> I've had girls suck my dick after I put my dick in their ass, and I'm like, Ugh, you fucking yeah. pig. That's gnarly. Uh, That's gnarly as fuck, but they'll do it. Those bitches are out there. Yeah, That's dude. called a fudgesicle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, let's get to yeah, our, our called, seeds. Double chocolate when he does it. Mm-hmm. All right, let's go. Lewis, what's your seed? <clears throat> my seed is um, it's uh, my newly found sobriety. Um, yeah, I, I've never done it like this. I've never gone just completely sober all at once. So I haven't smoked weed or drank in like nine days. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping that this lasts. I don't want to be super declarative and say that it's forever or whatever it is. But I, I know that I'm trying to get in better shape. I'm, I have a lot of things, a lot of irons in the fire right now, and I want to execute on the highest level. So I don't want to fucking look back and regret not being completely clear headed, not being completely, you know, ready to fucking pounce on these opportunities. So I think getting sober, not only the health side, but psychologically, mentally, 
um, if I want to level up and get to the next level, um, I think it's a good thing for me to do. So right now I'm completely. You're getting, you're sober right now. No weed, no nothing. Nothing. I'm not even on Vivance anymore. I'm not doing anything. Yeah, like Vivance. That. What's Vivance? Vivance is like rich kid Adderall. Ian Fidance. It's when he comes in your throat to kind of give you energy. <laughs> yeah. That was the girl he was talking about. Hell yeah. yeah. Good job, dude. Lewis, yeah. you should hang out with some like-minded people, you know, a little like an hour at a time. Yeah, I, I don't know if I need uh, I'm not gay, so I don't need a support group to pat me on my back. I got, you know, <laughs> oh, I hope fine. you fail. Well, maybe I might wow. I might fail. I might, but there's no I'm not defining it as like I'm not saying that I'm gonna be sober forever. I know at the very least until I do this fight, um, I, I wanna uh be sober and then we'll see. I you know, so and uh, at least six months I, I'll say I'll be sober. We'll see. Maybe it'll be forever. If I'm if I feel a lot better and everything goes the way that I want it to, I could see myself doing it forever. Are when you fighting again? Fight? Are you fighting again? Yeah, I'm supposed yep. to be fighting. When, when is the fight? We don't have a date, but uh, it's me versus Jason Ellis, and he just launched his podcast. We're talking probably still another five, six months because he, he he has a lot of stuff going on, so he keeps on sort of pushing it back. He's also had surgery, so but the more time I have to get in shape and prepare, the better. I mean, oh, I got a new seed now. Well, what is it? What is it? That was a joke. You had to do some arithmetic. Lewis said he has a big fight, and I said I have a new seed. I want him to win. <laughs> I know I I bet it against Lewis last time and this and to my uh I, I lost some money on it. I did it because nobody was betting against him. I will never bet against Lewis. I'm betting a thousand dollars on Lewis this time. Never bet against me. I know Jason Ellis has got a lot of a lot more experience. Everyone's got oh, he's got head tattoos and face tattoos and blah 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 blah. Joe Rogan said you're gonna get beat. Joe Rogan ain't shit, doggy. He ain't ready to step to this shit. Dude, Rogan would turn you out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I will pick Rogan up and I'll make him hit himself with his own hands. Are you fucking <laughs> Are you my, Rogan would sidekick you into tomorrow. I would crush you, dude. Fine, dude. I would fuck. I'll, I'll literally bend Rogan over my knee and spank him. Dude, I would. I'll make him tell me what he wants for Christmas first and then I'll bend him over and spank him right on his ass. Man, I, I, mean, be great I, fear man. I fear no man. This is who you guys are. You guys are fearing a man for me through me. It's fucking crazy. That's how no, gay you, you guys are. You're a man who went on that man's podcast and called him Mr. Rogan. Yeah, yeah, but, Mr. yeah, yeah. So you're fearing a man through another man through another man. Through another man. Oh, Michael that Bisping, Mr. Bisping. Every time we do a show, you can call me Mr. <laughs> you probably adopted that though. You yeah, adopted that so you wouldn't look like an asshole. You started calling Rogan. people Mister. <laughs> fucking asshole! You fucking dumb fucking Mrs. Soder. Fuck face. <laughs> Suck my. I know. Two K on Ellis. I'm putting two K on Ellis. <laughs> I'm fucking big money, dude. Get money on Ellis all fucking day long, bitch. Lose your money. We'll I'm see what the fuck happens. I'm a we'll, it's, it's money. A fight. It's suck a fucking it, fight. Fucking suck it. Fuck it. Suck it. <laughs> <laughs> no, Lewis is tough. I know Lewis is tough because we have the same trainer, and the trainer always says the only person that's close to you with skill wise is Lewis. Whoa. I also yeah. have wow. the same trainer. Yeah. Lewis, you just got your purple belt, correct? What do you guys what do you guys go to the Allen of Jiu Jitsu? Oh, you your first yeah, literally, class. yes. Yeah, we, we all go to the same <laughs> <laughs> he goes, Get on top. Go of course, grab the arm. You're grabbing Lewis, the arm. Did you just get your first stripe, Lewis? Yeah, I got my first stripe in uh Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Oh, that's great. Congratulations. Me and my son are at the exact same level. Nice. <laughs> Can your son fuck your shit up? Can your son <laughs> tap you out? I didn't get a little uh, experience. All right, Dan. Um, I mean, uh, what, what's your name? Uh, Scopo. Scopo. Yes, thank you. Uh, I, I'm, also, I'm also sober, so I'll take that into the c consideration. I like that. Mm. And my puppy right here. I'll take him. Oh, let's see I hope puppy. he dies in your hands right now. Like if he just, oh <laughs> right. he, just up, he just picks up a dead puppy and you go, <laughs> that, that, that thing's not alive. Oh. 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 oh, this is Seaver. Seaver. It's not funny. It's never funny. <laughs> it's so boring here it's so boring please lick him if he's not funny <laughs> <laughs> he's licking his balls right now <laughs> okay all right uh gabby what do you got my seed um <laughs> She won't yeah, suck, better, better, yeah, 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 suck it a dick after. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll suck a dick after having sex. Jesus Christ. Have you ever yeah. tried it, Gab? No, I have no. I mean, no. You don't even know what you don't like. Yeah, Gab, you, you know what? As my as as my mother always says, you can't say you don't like something until you yeah. try it. Maybe it tastes Gabby, like rainbow. Mom knows. Yeah. Gabby should yeah. freeze her seed because no one wants to fuck her. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm doing very well sexually. Thank you so much. Um 
I would say my seed. I'm gonna get a full time job again. <laughs> I'm, gonna go go I'm gonna go back to working full time. Go You're gonna go to work. Yeah, you have, I've been you have this a regional time. Emmy. You gotta get a day job. Yeah, Damn, dude. I can't float on this regional Emmy forever. It's crazy. All right, uh, Dan, what do you got? What's your seed? <laughs> My seed is hopefully the road will be back in 2021, and we can That's start. The seed is you can't say I hope something's coming back. It has oh, to be something that you put into action true. in order to, to make it. All right, for Luis J. Gomez, Mister. I can I can I guess what Dan's seed's gonna be? Yeah, what is it? I'll say that Dan, Dan's girlfriend will be pregnant within a year. No, she's not going to ruin a career. Yeah, you're right, Lewis. You, I'm not as <laughs> yeah. Bobby nailed it. Uh, my seed is dripping down your girlfriend's leg. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> just batching anywhere else, anywhere else but the, with the red, but the hot zone. Um, no, I would say my seed is a a thing that I'm working on right now that hopefully becomes a bigger thing. It's a an animated idea that I had that I get to work with one of my childhood heroes. So I hope it goes forward. Dan, Joe you Montana, your showrunner? Yep. Joe <laughs> Montana. Dan, you better not be selling our cartoon without me, you piece of oh, shit. Oh, you're not on the script anymore, bro. You're not on there. Little thing called edit on final draft. <laughs> no. Joe, so are you calling Deepu right now? Yeah. <laughs> get a one way bus <laughs> in Newark. Joe, what do you got? Uh, my seed is similar to what uh, you know you shared about your rose. I've been spending a lot of time on mental health. I got a great meditation practice. I'm sober, f like for real, actual sober, and I put a lot of work in on that. Mine's going to last longer than three weeks, and I just feel good. I want to keep this mental health going, and uh, I feel I feel the best I've ever felt mentally, and that's all from really putting in the work with sobriety and meditation, and I'm going to keep that going. That's great. Cool. My seed is uh, my land in New Hampshire. I want to uh, get a uh, tiny home and put it on and have it up by the summer. So, okay. Mm -hmm. so All right, I want to have. Yeah, I want to have my land because I've been vacationing in New Hampshire for th over thirty years. Don's been going their whole life to the same place. And um, we we've always been a guest. And la I, I, last year, I was just like, I don't want my son to be a guest. Yeah. In somebody's place, I don't want him to be like, Hey, can we stay here? I want him to just to fucking be able to go. And he loves New Hampshire. We all love the spot. We bought land, and hopefully, we get a spot up there. So this summer, we'll be able to go up there and be in our place. And then uh, and invite you fags up to come and hang. So Do you mind if I write my manifesto on your land? I got a whole Kaczynski thing coming. Well, we we're gonna <laughs> rent it out, Airbnb it, so you could definitely rent it. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Nice. So, what, what are you gonna sleep outside of the tiny home, or I don't understand how that's gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> you fuck no. Yeah. It's gonna be big enough for me. Just for you. It sounds like a medium <laughs> home. <laughs> you can actually fit six people in this thing. Now, it so sounds Bobby like a, a medium home. You guys have to alternate like days. It's right. Got, yeah. It's got no. It's you can fit six couples. That's uh, not. A, that's it's not a tidy home. Twelve. It's a people? big house. Yeah. yeah, dude. What is that? A three bedroom, three no, bath. Six, you can fit six people. Six people. Three couples. Sorry. Yeah. What is that? Three bedroom, that's three bath. What is it? Nice. What are you talking here? And. Uh, it's got a full bathroom, full shower, full kitchen, living room. It's a TV house. Room. Yeah, you're buying a house. No, it's a tiny home. Why do you keep calling it a tiny home? It's a tiny home. What do you want me to tell you? What it's defines tiny. a tiny, tiny home? home. I want to tell you it's what? a regular home. Yeah. No, it's not a regular home. You don't know what Bobby a regular goes, home is. Bobby so walks Bobby. in and he goes, now this is a regular size house. And they go, Bobby, this is a Costco. <laughs> <laughs> All, right, dude. All right. Well, dude. <laughs> yeah, I hope, I hope, I hope that happens. And I hope the only way it's going to happen. My, my seed is going to happen is if Dan casts me in his seed. Maybe. Yeah. What kind of walk. voice do you need, dude? Hey, man. Yeah, dude, you got voices. You got ah. voices for days. Mm, you sick Yoda. Nope. Whoever that was, you're fired. Mm. <laughs> Miss nope. Piggy. 
Nope, you're out, Miss Piggy. You're fine. Hey, you need a mechanic? Hey, what kind of people are they? Eh? Lou, uh, oh. wait, hold on, guys. Question from the back of the line, Chris. Yeah, go you, ahead. You need a mechanic? Uh, no, we're okay. Uh, we got it. Uh, we got one on right. site. Do you need someone who has a regional Emmy? Gabby, stop doing your kiss face. We all know you don't taste your own brand. It's weird. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Oh, my belly button's <laughs> killing. Gabby, I really hope it looks like she just tasted herself. Yeah. I'm hoping Gabby oh. knocks over her fake Emmy and the globe falls off of it. <laughs> 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 All right, so there we go. I don't know where Mush went. Mush is uh, out of this. I don't know why. I don't know where he went. But he uh, we're doing our gifts now. Mush, do you have a seed, Mush? Your mic's not on. Not really. <laughs> Jesus, it's so oh, sad. Gosh. Oof. How about living, Mush? Uh, hopefully. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I just sent you a gift. Live until that comes, okay? Modest, modest Mike. <laughs> He's like, Are you, you know what? A, uh, I guess my seat is doing the, the podcast with uh, Greg Stone. Hey, Greg Stone. All right. All right. It's a good seed. All right, so here we go. That's your seed. Gabby, you got numbers? Yep. Eight, right? Let's get into this. We got eight. Ari okay. Shakir is one of them. But Ari's not here. Okay, who yeah. has every number? Scopo's one. Bobby's two. No, you got to pick the numbers. Yeah, but we have so, to. So, so, all right, so I'm going to go first. Decides I'll go pick. One. Whoever I'll gets pick. one is in the best position. Yeah, right. so yeah. I I pick first. Okay. Then it goes Scopo. Then it goes Mush. Then it goes uh, Dan, uh, Lewis, Joe, then you. So Gabby's right. picking for everybody. The lower the number you get, the better it is because you're so, trading. All right. Right. No, pick no, my no, no. The pick higher me. the number, the better, but number one is the best. Okay, got yes. it. So pick my number. Okay. But you have to hold it up. We have to see you doing it. Yeah, we can't yeah. cheat. Yeah. Oh, hold those it up. fingers are awful. I know. Yeah, are are ready? Right, what? They what like you're, you're cranking around the ball. What is it? Two. Yes. Oh, no. That's the worst number. That's the worst number. The worst worst one, number. Dude. Bad? That's, That's the worst so number. Weird. Why is that my bad? My show. My show, dude. Okay. I can't so, get this tiny house, dude. If I don't get this tiny house <laughs> with this number I got, dude. <laughs> I can kill you, dude. Uh, 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 <laughs> it makes me so happy that Bobby got number two. Yeah, dude, that's fucking great. That is funny. <laughs> okay, Scopo. Oh. You ready? Yep. There comes number three. Guarantee number three. Four. Damn. Uh, 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 that's, what, that's what girls say you are. A four. <laughs> four. <laughs> that's not bad. I'll take it. It's way better than number two. Okay, Soder. Number one, baby. Every fucking year. It's guy who does. You know what? Soda's the luckiest motherfucker in the world. I mean, every fucking year, every, every, every year. year. Career, he, this guy has had one lull in his career. Yeah, Other than, you know, I had a fucking, it's been awesome. I've been out here doing great. <laughs> Other than a parent and a sibling dying at a young age, Soder has all the luck. <laughs> <laughs> I got a big ass mouth, Joe. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> I knew we was gonna get. I knew we was gonna get one. Okay, next. <laughs> Five. Who's, that? Who's Who's number is this? Lewis. Who is, Who is it? Lewis. No, Lewis. Put that one up. Put that. No, not that one. Three. Three. It's three. <laughs> Did you do Mike? Pick another one. Pick no, Lewis not yet. Three. Yeah. No, Mike yes. Yes. Three. Oh, oh, that's a good number. Yes, that's the right. second best number. Second is best it? Number. Why is it the second? Because it's the last one. Eight's the last one. Oh, eight's the last one. Joe. Eight of us. The third, the, yeah. Ari, Ari, Ari. Ari. For no reason. Ari's not even here. He shouldn't even fucking be involved. And he's a what? fucking Jew. He doesn't even celebrate Christmas. He's a wow. real Jew. I'm wow. a Jew. Okay. Are you Jewish, Gabby? Yes. yes. Oh, that turned me the fuck on. Ugh. Mm. <laughs> okay. Uh, Joe, ready? Yeah. Eight, baby. Oh, Joe. Three, 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 three. Five. Yeah. Five. All right, all right. Okay. Better than two. Mushy. 
Mush. Mush is going to get eight. Mush is going to get eight. Finally, some luck for Mush. <laughs> I want to warm up that Six. light. Okay, Six. okay. So Gabby. All right, so now Ari. Now Ari? I guess. Is Gabby going to get the second best number? Oh, that's right. Last year was Gabby's panties. It's been a whole yeah. year. Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah. Where it's, are been they? A year. it's our year anniversary. Aw. Eight. Ah! Whoa! Sorry, Emmy. Sorry. Stupid. Sorry. Two Sorry, white people on the show Sorry, always get all the luck. Three, wow. So who's picking right. for Ari? Or this shit, Bobby, why didn't you think this out? Do we Ari's not here? I didn't why think is it out. Part of this? Why did you think I thought it out? Can I say this? Can we kick Ari out of this and just fucking donate his gift? I because he's not here. He can't be involved with it. He can't pick a gift. He, we have to fake it. It's stupid. Yes, it's fucking you know stupid. Yeah, but then we have to do the whole thing over again. No, we don't. No, no, we don't. No, we don't. Eight. Eight. Ari's seven. eight. Ari's eight, so it eliminates and we go so right to seven. 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 It eliminates eight. You, all right. So what I'm saying from Dan. I like that joke. From Dan, Joe, Louis, Scopo. You guys want to eliminate Ari Shafir? Yeah. yeah. I want to eliminate him off the planet. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Old school oven, baby. You don't baby. even know his gift. <laughs> his gift. You don't even care about his gift? No. I'd like I'd to see his gift. Shit. What, is it? Shit what is it? What is it? Something illegal from a country. Is it yeah. wisdom? Fuck that. How about we have a contest for Ari's gift at the end of it? Okay. Perfect. Okay. All right, hey, this Ari's we out. We eliminated the Jew. Because you guys are racist. No, that's not true. Anti-Semitic. There's a difference. Yeah, I just don't like that his dick is all thick and nice. It's a, it's a big old piece. <laughs> Covered in words. Ari tasted his own cum? Yes. Yeah, of yeah. course. What? That's how Jews procreate. <laughs> They're like frogs. <laughs> yeah, they come into their own mouth and fucking shoot. I don't shoot. know. Frogs even do they that. They shoot six off their back. <laughs> Who's first? Number one. Soda's number one. Like in our hearts. Man. So I what do we see? Their, everyone's gonna hold up their gifts to see what they look like, the sizes, the packages. Mm. The weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. Goes if there's low. no place to go, I want to see Bobby. Let it snow. Let it snow. Let it snow. Okay. I am between. Oh. All I have is this thing. What is this? Oh, Scopo. Oh, oh, it's cool, Scopo. They ran well, out of wrapping paper at the Rite Aid by me, so I just have a bag of bows. <laughs> well, I was found out uh, an hour and a half before that was on the show. So. Bobby has a paper bag. What do you got? A fucking uh, sausage sandwich? That's, what a, is that? that's a, that's a, a DeRosa, chicken. DeRosa sandwich. Oh, dude, I don't want Joey Rose. All right, I'm going to go with... Can I say this real quick? Bobby, if you got sandwiches and we're not in the same fucking studio and that's your fucking gift, I, I really want you to be dead. <laughs> like you can't fucking get a bag of sandwiches you're gonna fucking eat later on. Be like, yeah, dude, look at the bit. Joe List, I'm going with your gift. Ooh, thanks. First of all, uh, that warms my heart. I appreciate that. I take that as a high compliment. I, I, I'm insulted that you didn't take mine. I don't okay. want your bag of meat. I don't care for the haggis. Uh, First up, five dollar gift card to Starbucks. Ooh. Nice coffee, and Ooh. and I think you're gonna like this. I don't know if you're yeah. gonna love it, but I think you're gonna like it. Guardians of the Galaxy Groot Chia Pet. Love it. <laughs> Joe, don't like it. Love it. Is it baby Groot or Groot? It's, it's it is. Groot. It just says potted Groot. I don't think they have the rights to it. So it just says potted Groot. Easy to do. Fun to grow. Marvel. Oh, there's a Marvel logo. And it's Groot. And Dan, you're a little bit like Groot. You know, you're very likable. You're heroic. You're tall. I, you're. I am. Uh, I am. I dare I am so <laughs> and coffee. Love it. Groot that's and great. coffee. That's, that's a good, good that's a good that's pick. A great gift. Number two. Number two. Who's number two? That's you, yeah. Bob. Where's right, let me see the, the gift? Bucket. Hold your gifts up. Yeah, we got I'm gonna write these down because I want to know what the gifts are so then I can see what I want to fucking steal later if I need to steal what them. What the fuck is Dan got a thing of ribbons? <laughs> it's bow, in there. Dude. His gift is in there. I'm going ah fuck. I'm going I Lewis. Bring great gifts every time. I'm going okay. Lewis. I'm going Lewis. Okay. Lewis. Up for you. Come on, baby boy. What do you got for me? This is a Kayo Razor Whoa. webcam with a built in wow. light. What really? is it? Kayo Razor uh, webcam with a built in ring light. It's really high quality. Um, that's a yes. podcast sponsor. I can tell. No, no, it's not a podcast sponsor. Actually, I literally just bought these for a bunch of people that have to stream for uh, at home. It's uh, about one hundred and twenty dollars. 
And uh, Lewis, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm dropping hundred twenty dollars. But I will say uh, he, is, he is doing well. Thank you. Thank you. And it's I'm glad really, it's really it's it's what? really good quality. You don't have to have a lighting setup. This is great if you want to go on the road, Bob. You want to look pretty good still. Um, yeah. You have a great streaming setup at home. Scopo yeah. needs this shit right now. Um, yeah. So it's it's a it's a it's a webcam. It's Thank great. For, all the gamers use this one. Um, I love I it. it so my excited. streams, my Zoom streams I, as well. I love it. Thank you. I don't want to be like an asshole here, but I just want to let people know since we're saying the price. Evidently, the Groot was 158 bucks. <laughs> 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 okay, go ahead. So That's Dan, you pay, so it's mine, right? So yeah. you you want to keep that, or do you want? You I, can take root and so I make, Oh, I make that choice. You want? Right? You could trade if you want. You obviously have I, great I want the already. camera. I want the camera. Yeah, you don't have a good camera. Yeah. Good point. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's my turn. Yes. Let's see all the gifts again. Starbucks with Groot. She a pet. Let's go, Bobby. You gonna go me? Yeah. Bobby. Okay. If this fucker, well, if this fucking off, fat fuck has sandwiches in that bag, I'm gonna fight him. <laughs> first off, you're gonna get a nice American flag mask. I yeah. Love it. Whoa. Whoa. America. Gabby, yeah. why would that make you cringe, Gabby? You fucking leftist whore. You go to fucking Canada, bitch. I just said okay. Okay, wait, there's more. Ready? I it already have be. Corona. So I care about Look masks. at this. This is a good vibes dry erase board. It's great. For my through. high school locker. Right? Okay, but it lights up. It has lights, so you can write your stuff on it oh and it God. lights up. This. It can be a little <laughs> nightlife. You can put photos on it. Very Bobby, nice. bought that. Bobby bought that in March when he thought he was going to write a sitcom during pandemic. <laughs> and then and then one more gift you ready this is a an essential stand three in one airpods apple watch and your iphone phone you'd have all to in, here, and you can in order to make it worthwhile <laughs> does anybody have all three an apple watch airpods and an iphone gabby does i don't have an apple watch but you so, can get one now for christmas an apple watch would be a nice gift have a watch. There you go. So that's what you get right there. You get three gifts. Look at that. That's an expensive one, too. This is a good mask. Yeah. How much was that mask, Bobby? So How we're naming you? prices this year. So what are you going to do? So I'm going to take Lewis's camera. You cunt. <laughs> nice. What? <laughs> you, don't, you have an Emmy. A regional. <laughs> Man, that's a fucking. You can't. She has a paperweight. It's a regional. Oh my God! You're taking the camera. The camera's worth more than the Emmy. Oh my stomach! <laughs> I heard you can get that Emmy for eighty-eight ninety-five. <laughs> I got it on Amazon. Gabby got that Emmy in a Yankee swap. Yeah. <laughs> my belly button. It's dancing me. The guy goes. Somebody else traded with her. They didn't want the regional Emmy, so they gave it to her. They go. I'm going to take Gabby's gift certificate. She can have my regional Emmy. So no, who wait, gets not, my gift? That's at the end. You get your gift now. I don't want my gift. I want my camera. Well, you don't have your camera anymore, but well, hopefully somebody wants your gift bad enough to trade you with a better gift. Well, my gift is very good. So go ahead. Next. Okay. Four. Who's That's four? Me. me. Uh, I'll take Soders. All right, Chris Scopo. What a good one. Let's see what we got what in the got bag there? of fun. Actually, this is probably the best for Scopo. Get some of these nice. Tactical glasses. Hey, all right. Uh, Perfect for paintballing. Perfect for paintballing. <laughs> and oh, oh, a mic guard for your microphone. So he needs a okay. microphone. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know what? He's gonna have to worry about that, Lewis. Because I want a pop screen. You fucking not working an audio asshole. Pop screen. It is right here. A mic a guard. Shield. <laughs> that a mic guard. <laughs> my guard. Oh, my no guard. mic. You got him a mic guard and glasses. <laughs> you got him a fucking a shock jock starter kit. This is pretty cool, <laughs> dude. This is the Louis J. Gomez starter kit. There it is. You the yellow glasses and the fucking pop screen. That gift stinks, Dan. Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, I don't have as good of sponsors as you do, Lewis. This was not sponsored. I will show you the fucking receipt. Yeah. I wish they sponsored me. Also, a bag of bows if you're really into it. 
Nice. Lewis, I'll sponsor your sobriety. Will you be my sponsor, Joe? Yeah, I'll be your sponsor. Can we do bro. a podcast and it's just our meeting each week? Uh, uh, that's not how it works. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, dog. We can monetize our sponsorship. Scopo, <laughs> do you want to be Lewis? Hmm? You know what? Five years ago, no. But this year, I'll definitely be Lewis. Doing yeah. well in life. Hell mm-hmm. yeah. Okay. So, so you're you keeping to- it. You're not going to take my gift. You're not oh, going to trade it? I, 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 I forgot how to do this. It's been He's three years since you invited the me. the webcam. You can take my gift. Oh, no. I definitely want the webcam. Ah, good. Really yeah. nice. I'm Lewis now, baby. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she so starts rating herself. Get <laughs> so Christ. you get it. Gabby, Gabby you, get camp, right? you get the pop screen in the glasses. Cool. Cool. Okay. Who's next? I think it must be me. I'm five, right? Yep, yep, five. Who has gifts left? Can I see the gifts, the wrapped gifts? Ooh, Mike's looks like a burrito. I'd like that. Ooh, gold. Gabby's is a dumb book. Scopo sucks, I can tell. Gabby, how could you buy a book for this show? You That's suck. Oh my God. I'm going to go with Gabby's. Gabby's interesting me because I like books. You That's can tell my God. You're your own coos. You're going to love this. Oh, that sound. That sound was great, though. That was very satisfying. This is a vagina coloring book where you color in a bunch of different vages and it's peaceful and it's meditative. That's a sushi vag. This is a cupcake vag. I hate feminism worse than I hate anything in the world. I hope that (laughs) you fire and everyone in your apartment complex dies because of it. Wait, wait, hold a on. A bit of brownstone, you piece of shit. Can we do a trademark date on that? Because I have my watercolor cock book coming out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's just dicks and go. different things. Okay, so what is it again? It's a webcam. <laughs> <laughs> I got, you know what? I got a web camera. I, I, I got all the sound equipment. Joe, look. Look at all this stuff. Uh, this is pretty nice, Joe. You can always have an extra one going the road with. Bobby, yours is an end of the fucking aisle CVS. Like the, <laughs> the, <laughs> it's next to the hostess cupcakes. Uh, Dan's is too, because I almost got those glasses. Yeah, dude. Well, I ordered them off the actual television, Bobby. Like a really sad man. I'm actually Ooh. hyped about the glasses. Oh, Who currently God. has Groot? Because I kind of like this Groot. Dan. Hey, listen. I forgot about this. What? 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 You just, just found out diet, a bag. A He's just picking up other yes, things off the floor. What is it? He's just you picking just up other things off his it. fucking shed right yeah, now. Bobby, <laughs> I wish you would have shown me that. because I would have kept it. I'm in the market for a leg pillow. I this might have goes, come in, back on this that goes one. into the... Uh, Bobby's the giving away his mother's gifts. <laughs> uh, you know what? No, no. Oh, I dropped something too. Hold on. A remote. Oh. I have tarot cards. I could could throw these in. I dropped something too. It's a codec machine from Sirius XM satellite radio. (laughs) So if you want to broadcast live. You guys are going to want running on empty, overcoming your childhood emotional neglect. This is also in there. Also, there's a uh, a, a 21 Jump Street themed Yeti. I'll throw Uh, in a regional Emmy with my name on it. Who wants Uh, a dog? Anybody want a dog? Dog in there. (laughs) Put the dog in there. Not that ugly oh. dog. Uh, shut up. <laughs> All right. um, I'm going to switch with uh, Dan, who I think has the Chia pet. Is that right? Because here's the thing. No one's mailing their gifts. So I want the <laughs> gift that I have in my hand. Right. So I'm okay. switching with Dan. I'm okay. taking the Chia pet. Dan, you currently have Let a me make this book. I'm okay. buying three more of these right now. So I'm going to just keep this one and give it to who I need to give it to. And I'm just going to ask whoever takes this for their address and it'll be shipped directly to their home. Yeah, Sorry. I'm not shipping shit. So I'm taking the uh, the chia pet. <laughs> Dan, you have the coloring book. Great. Who's next? Uh, me. So it's just me and Scopo's gifts, right? Oh yep. uh, yeah. Yeah. So I'll pick your gift. All righty, you're gonna get a, a once in a lifetime. I'll this take the camera. Dennis right? Dennis Rodman Baba bobblehead thing. That's pretty cool. Oh, I That's love not a bobblehead. It's not a bobblehead. It's not a bobblehead. It's a doll. I actually got it from Dennis Rodman. A bobblehead. Is that a chew toy for a dog? Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, my ex roommate Albanese interviewed Dennis Rodman, and he was giving these out. Mm. So this is actually from Dennis Rodman. <laughs> well, if, if I was a fucking loser, that would matter. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if I was a fucking idiot loser, who? <laughs> I, oh my god, Dennis Rodman touched this Dennis Rodman doll. 
Uh-huh. Isn't that erotic? <laughs> I think Bobby's just uh, reading a book at this point. Is that, it? <laughs> is that the whole gift? That's all. I had an hour and a half fucking to, to get something. That's true, so, that's you true. know what? So this is what you get. I'll take the camera. So. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. By the way, I always bring the best gift every year, without a doubt. It That's never. True. So I, I, this is mine. Oh, I still have to pick. Yeah. yeah. Right. Yep. Who, he was number six, so I get to pick your gift. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let me get yours. And then who was number one? Dan was number one, so he gets to choose at the very end. So, as you know, last year uh, my dog Jasper passed away. Oh, You're giving us his ashes, dude. <laughs> is that what did it say? What did it say? What? Jasper, I got a, an urn, and you can get Jasper's ashes. What? It's Jasper's oh. ashes? Yeah, dude, that's dark. That's fucked up, dude. Well, you gotta give it to my dog. Supported Jasper towards the end, and my dog needs a friend. friend. He needs a dude. friend. Yeah, well, does he it. want a ghost buddy? Because Jasper will help him out. Dude, that is dark. A ghost buddy. I want that. I want Louis. Jasper. Louis, do you want that? <sighs> not the camera, I guess. You're not going to take the camera? You're not going to take ashes. Take the, take the, the dog's ashes. Are great. Put him in the studio. Hey, what do you have right now? I have the JJ coloring book. Fuck, Dan's going to take the camera, and then i got to be stuck with the JJ coloring book. Unless Dan doesn't take the camera, because Dan looks like he's got a decent camera. Nope. And Christine just ordered this camera for Big J, Probably also ordered this camera for you, right? Nope. <clears throat> I'm gonna get mine, dude. Um, I'm gonna get mine. Let me see. So hold on. Really, what I should do is pick the one that I think Dan's not gonna take. What's the yes. next best gift? Yes, Bobby. Really, if you do, is have this conversation in your head. Bobby's gift, the JJ coloring book. Let me see what I got here. We have the Grout, Groot, and Starbucks. Grout. Uh, oh, I just found this came out too. This dropped. Out of the bag. What is it? What that thing? You got the sunglasses and the pop. You don't want Bobby that. Bobby uses that to put on his shoes because he can't reach. <laughs> You're. Oh, look what I found. Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. Play boy. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a shot in the dark because I don't care about any of these gifts. The camera would be nice, and then I don't have to buy another camera. I save 120 dollars if this works out the way that I wanted to. I'm taking the camera back. Great. <laughs> now we'll just see we'll, what Dan does now. If Dan has a funny bone in his body. We'll I'm see. taking the camera. Damn it! Fuck you! Fucking <laughs> JJ book. Fuck you, Gabby. Yeah, you bitch. Lewis absolutely yeah. deserves the JJ book. And Lewis, I will text you my address to send that camera. <laughs> you know, for a fact, I'm going to also color it in and jerk off to it. Fine. If this yeah. is the yeah. perfect gift for you. It is the second best gift. I got to be honest with you. Yeah, <laughs> that camera's sweet. There was no Wait way no one not that camera. Who who gets? Who gets Mush's gift? Does he keep his dog? Yeah. 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 Dog God, he should keep them. Keep them. <laughs> God damn it. I want those. I want to put them. I have Diva right there. Diva's. I usually had Deepu right there. <laughs> yeah. I have, have Deepu's ashes action. right there. Oh, shucks. Guess I'll have to keep Groot. Chia pet. <laughs> Suckers. God damn it. We should put the ashes well, in the studio. So what are we going to do for Ari's gift? We'll get, uh, well, let's well, shoot let's, it into space. I How think about, you re- reveal it, and whoever deserves it, like, we'll know somebody's the most obvious for the gift, and that person right. should get it. Okay. I'm sure we'll d- degree, agree democratically. But what if, what if, uh, all right, what if it isn't perfect for somebody? Because it's, it's one few things. It's either something stupid and hilarious or something awesome. Like, Ari, okay. Ari could very well have sent something fucking incredible. Very true. So I almost feel like we should assess that risk. I don't know what it is. I got a video for him, from him, and I sent it to Mush because I wanted to watch it with everybody at the same okay. time. Let's see what's <laughs> right. going on. Let's see what's going on. Gabby has COVID. <laughs> I've already had it. You? Well, you got it again. I heard you cough. Uh, this is for Bobby's uh, Secret Santa. Secret Santa. Oh, cool. You can see a fucking oh, the reflection. You can see this fucking sweet ass deck. Uh, the mirror is off. It makes it look like I have a ball patch. But look at this fucking thing. What a great view. So, guys, uh, you know, as a Jew, um, we didn't have Secret Santa. Uh, we had secret uh, investment problems. And what we did was we took money away from Christians and we focused it towards Jewish-owned businesses. Um, but I love the Christmas spirit and I want to participate. 
So I got you, whoever got my name, the Secret Santa, Secret Yankee hat, um, something cute. What do you hate? What do you hate? What do we all hate? That's right, mosquitoes. <laughs> no one likes a mosquito. Not even other mosquitoes. They also get mosquito bites. So I got you the sweet ass mosquito incense holder and incense together. That's right. You just light it on fire and then you slowly burn it like this. It works its way around. There's a shitload extra. And it keeps the mosquitoes away at a rate of like eh, 40, 50%. So, um, I don't know what you got me, but I hope uh, it's more valuable than that. And um, I don't know. Happy Christmas. And uh, I th what do you guys say? What is it? Celebration of the day Jesus first learned how to masturbate? I think it's something like that. Anyway, I'm Ari Shafir. And I'm your secret Santa. Was I muted? I was making so many fucking jokes like a moron the yeah, whole too. time. Me he too. said, what does everyone hate? I said, the Jews. Then it was like, you light it on fire. I was like, yeah, the Jews. <laughs> I mean, I was, I was fucking crushing. Then I looked down and I said, mute like a fucking asshole. So unmute yourself. Fuck you. Whoa. Who has a piano? Yeah, who's playing the fucking... Oh, it's just a shit I hit, table. I hit my, uh, my piano. mic stand. That was a yeah. gong. You, you hit your dildo on a... On a but Man, are we yeah. so lucky we cut him out of that? Yeah, Just like a Jew tough. talking about money, they're not giving it away. Whoa. Mm, Mike, put that in the yeah, fucking right. intro. Put right, Snowboard in the coming in right fucking hot, dude. Yeah, Jesus Try. Christ. Yuck. Well, thank God we didn't get that. Yet again, Dan Soda fucking wins everything. Hi, I'm Dan Soda. Suck my asshole. I'm taking that camera. That's a good camera, Dan. It is. Thank you, Lewis. You're a good Santa, buddy. Love you. I love you, too. Today, a big snowstorm is about to hit. Wait, wait. Real quick. Who kept their own gift? It's like four of us. I I, I have. I, I, mean, I mean, uh, Joe. Yeah. I like my Dennis Rodman. Did anybody get my gift or do I keep this? You keep that. You no, keep one liked it. It. no one liked any gift except for mine. Yet again. <laughs> Lewis is right, though. I gotta start phoning it in and not spending money on this fucking no. game. It no, never... last year was Dan's gift. It was the projector that I got. Oh, yeah. No, 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 that was Bobby's that gift. Was... No, 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 Dan. Dan got it free from Comedy Central. Yeah, yeah no, Dan yeah. got that. I got, but your gift was good last year, too. It was a was dick sucking machine. No, that was oh, a year was... before. What was yeah. my gift last year? I don't, I don't know. Remember. I brought some. I brought some fucking hot gifts to this fucking show, though. Yeah, Didn't I, you bring I, I got a. I got a lap dance from a tranny. You remember when I almost fist fought that fucking porn star that you brought in? Yeah, Dude, that was awesome. <laughs> with her tits out. I know. And I got a yeah, fucking with the front of that, like Lewis is violent towards women. I was like, only ones like that. <laughs> <laughs> fucking caged animal. What am I supposed to do? She's threatening to beat me up. Am I supposed to not fucking at least give her a fucking one of those? Bitch, what are you doing? What are you doing, bitch? What are you remember, doing? Remember, remember, we told her she couldn't show her tits, so she we got her a piece of shitty <laughs> artwork that we said you have to hold this up. So while she was trying to fight you, she was just holding that painting over her tits, <laughs> trying to hit you with her tit painting. Oh god damn it! All right, listen, this has been a fucking great episode. I love each and every one of you. I love you uh, too, so guys. much. I love you. I love uh, you all. Scopo, good seeing you. Scopo, Most great seeing you. Bobby. Stuka, Bobby. I told you to get for Stuka on. Yeah, I thought we were going to get uh, for Stuka. She, no, she, she never She did not respond. Wow. Wait, I was I was out after for Stuka? You, no, you were no, in, you, Honestly. No, you were in was the first slip. You were in the first. You, we wanted you. You and for Stuka. Was, it was supposed to be a big surprise for everybody to have both of oh. you guys. Yeah, uh, Stu Fistuka and Scopo and Deepu said no. <laughs> Deepu said no. No, Fistuka didn't even have the fucking respect to even respond. She goes, oh yeah, I want to do your last year. She want me to do something from 2012? No, thank you, Bobby. <laughs> I don't know if you know this, but the water flushes different down here, and so do the thoughts on you. Goodbye. <laughs> what was it? What's the girl from the, her country that killed it last year? What was it? What's her name? Hannah Gadsby has me opening for her. <laughs> Yes, I think I I was sad that the uh, that uh, what's your name Scopo didn't I mean uh, Fasuka. <laughs> <laughs> I was sad that Scopo said yes. I was sad that Kelly st said didn't answer us. That makes me sad. No. Surprising. I'm surprised you didn't at least fucking. Isn't it in the middle of the night down there? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, so maybe why. that's it. Yeah, that's why. Maybe we'll have it. When did you email her? Uh, what's morning. that? This morning? Yeah. Oh, well, no, you so fucking idiot. Yeah, you stink, yeah. Gabby. That's your problem. I've been yeah. Gabby, you, she's an idiot. I told her to do it yesterday. You really pulled up a stupid. We didn't do it last night. Last night is with her daytime. She I know, went, but I had I had a thing. You're no, a dumb a one. Yeah, that last night. Right. Two seconds. She had to polish her Emmy. You screwed <laughs> up the podcast. You could have sent a thing way before, you stupid bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sending you this for JJ, bro. Uh, I don't care. I got a. I don't oh, care. Wait, no, I good. got a camera and one from Louis <laughs> J. Gomez. You're a rude one, Gabby Bryan. <laughs> Don't you know. lick up your thumb. <laughs> you gotta taste your puss when you start <laughs> Gabby Bryan. Yeah. I wouldn't fuck you with a ten. Fuck you. Oh, fuck. I, love, I miss you guys. I want to be in the same room. Yeah, we could have uh, done it. We were going to do it at Gas Digital Studios. What happened? Yeah. There's a blizzard. There's yeah. a blizzard. There's a blizzard and there's COVID. Are you doing the snowing yet? Yeah. No, not yet. Screaming. This captures the time better. Are you pointing yes. at a watch right now? Sure. Yes. <laughs> Can we just rewind for a second? I love Kelly. I miss Kelly. But wh- how come everyone just pretended like it would have been better with Kelly? It would have trashed her to her fat face. It would have been hilarious. Yeah. You understand that? If you understand how funny it would have been, she. I, I love Kelly, but I know Lewis. No, you don't. Fucking- yeah, I do. No, I love the, Kelly. The, here's a problem because, like, Gabby, <laughs> no, go fuck yourself, you cocky cunt. I love Kelly. We I try, do. Too. We try to trash Gabby, but Gabby's actually. Pretty. I like Kelly a lot. So we call Ke- Kelly fat and ugly, like it hits harder because there's a little more truth there. <laughs> you know, no. Gabby's fingers are grosser than <laughs> anything that's ever come out of <laughs> Kelly Fasuka. I, I would rather eat Kelly Fasuka's <laughs> biggest dump she's ever taken than look at Gabby's fingers. <laughs> Gabby, hold your fingers up. Let's see your fingers. Again. Gabby, let's see your fingers. Oh, it hurts to look at them. Oh, Gabby, look at it, looks like, it looks like your hands are in pain. Oh, how fast can you paddle? So fast. <laughs> I'm flying in the water, baby. Oh, you're an aquatic animal. Oh. <laughs> Gabby once asked a kid to play patty cake, and the kid killed himself. <laughs> <laughs> She's got praying mantis hands. Oh, shit. oh, look at you in your Dick Van Dyke fucking pajamas. <laughs> But I'll tell you right now, Gabby, I'll say right now, the whole year you've been doing a great job at posting thirsty shit on Instagram. Very jerkable. A lot of the stuff what? that you've been posting. Extraordinarily jerkable. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> she did a shot. It was literally of her ass. It was just of her ass. Yeah. And you get to really see some lips hanging a little bit in the uh, uh. whatever. Oh, she was. Is it still I didn't I'm post it. You. Whatever, I got three secret accounts. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome. All right, so Lewis, Lewis, Dan, Joe, Scopo, Gabby, Mike, I love you guys. I do. I love, I love that you guys are all, all right. You're doing great. Most of you, some of you, are doing better than others. But thank you, you guys. You guys mean the world to me, and I mean it, mean it from my heart. I love you guys so much. You're my family. La Familia, and uh, we made it through another year. We're still in the business. We're kicking ass. Everybody's doing great, and uh, it means the world to me that we come together and still do this, and we're all still fucking hilarious, and this was uh, an amazing, fun, awesome fucking show, and I I, I love it, and I needed it, and uh, I, I hope we do it every year until one of us gets really famous and just doesn't do it. Um, <laughs> So, I love you guys, Joe. Joe, Joe, Joe. <laughs> Joe. You don't. I just gave Joe. my end of the show speech, and you fell asleep. Maybe Soder's cartoon could be huge. We might not, uh, <laughs> might not have him next year. He Don, might not be here. Let's just listen, this is honest. Even if I have to zoom in from the lot, 
I'll be uh, here. I for will. For an animated show. Uh, yeah. Um, Bob, I love yeah. you, buddy. Best. Love Thanks you, for having me. Are you, are Thanks, Max Bobby. Over Thanks. I'll see you. I'm Lewis. We'll see you this weekend. Go some sledding with the boys. I'm saying, is Max sleeping over on Friday? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I'm gonna, I don't want to say that to Jay. It's just, I haven't mentioned it to him yet, so I don't want to say I'm, it to Jay. As soon as I'm done, I'm going in. I talked to Dawn. She was cool with it. We're gonna talk to Max. I'll drop him off on the way to Uncle Vinny's. Mm-hmm. And and then uh yeah. This sounds so, like hey, this is a phone you call. Uncle Vinny's. Yeah. What what? Why are we doing phone calls at the end of the podcast? Yeah. Hey, Liz, I, I think I'm gonna yeah. be in Astoria next week. You wanna go out for lunch, maybe yeah. or, All right. We could do Bartolinos yeah, or something like that. Yeah, that's great. Uh, January 30th, I'll be at the Wall Street Theater in Norwalk, Connecticut, live streaming around the world that night, too. You so if you're not there, if you can't be there at live, you can uh pay-per-view it right to your living room, get some booze, get some food. Uh, you can fucking jerk each other off while I'm on stage. Uh, right in your living room. So make sure you go there, wallstreettheater.com. Uh, I'll tickets. be opening for Bobby on that gig, actually. So you guys will be, see- be seeing me. Yeah. Are you, are you opening for me? Yeah. Really? <laughs> I didn't know that. Right, uh, I love you guys so much. Merry Christmas, Bobby. Merry Christmas, yeah. everybody. Merry Joe, Christmas. Gabby, Merry, Merry Christmas, YKWD uh, like fans. You Merry guys Christmas, are the best. We'll see you next fans. week. You're Black the real watch, hero. You're jingle the real hero. Bell, jingle, jingle bell, bell, jingle bell, jingle bell. Hey, oh, what a fun it is to be a part of the play. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell. What a fun it is to be a part of the play. What a jingle ride. And D D B B B. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Let's do the real show now. Okay, bye. Uh, let's do the real show now. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. let's go. Let's go. Dude, how cool would it be now if Gabby showed her tits? D- D- Gabby, <laughs> for the how funny would it be that Bobby, Dan, and Liz didn't get to see him, and I did, and Mush did, and everybody else that's just here live did, and you edited it out. But they're gonna. You're so obsessed cool. with me. Obsessed. I think you're cute. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. Show yeah. Okay, buddy. Face, and it'll fucking it'll shove it right down Bobby's fucking asshole. Think about that, Gabby. Funny first. Go. Go ahead. Nah. Gabby, don't <laughs> fucking do it. You piece of shit. Don't fucking listen to him. It's Christmas time. You fucking don't listen to Satan. All right. You listen to the cute little elf. On your right shoulder, not that Puerto Rican elf on your left shoulder. He's Satan. My <laughs> the show. It's over. In what you the guys. world? Okay. Uh, you guys are my roads. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. You've been listening to the YKWD podcast. Thanks for listening. Now go back to your shitty jobs. Shitty jobs. Shitty jobs.